Hello everybody and welcome back to Mist. It has been a week. I've had time to think about everything I missed but um, last time. <laughs> I think I have a few ideas. I don't know if they are going to be correct or not. I, I say a few ideas. I have like one idea. I have one idea on like maybe how to fix the voltage thing and that's all I've thought of all week. But uh, now that I've actually figured out how to um, work the elevator, I, I feel like <laughs> I feel like it's going to be more smooth sailing from here on than it was last week. But it worked out kind of nicely either way. Like it, it became like a nice little like law exposition, getting to know what's going on kind of stream last time, having a like the chance to read through the journals and get like the backstory of everything and then because I was so stuck I ended up reading all of them so <laughs> so that did kind of work out but uh, I'm hoping that this week will be a bit smoother just a little bit I'm hoping <laughs> no more walking past the same things for three hours but uh yeah oh hello welcome Gigi hello welcome Nermits I'm also glad you woke up from your nap you you almost missed more <laughs> This is a stream that is not to be missed. I need to stop now. I, I must stop now. <laughs> but also, nobody's done the, the first redeem yet as well. So uh, if anyone wants to to grab the, the first redeem, nobody did it. <laughs> Which surprised me. Usually it's like the second the stream starts, it there is instantly the first redeem. Oh, there we go. There we go. GG, you got it. <laughs> Congratulations on the first. Oh, and I think you were first to post in chat, too, so it works out. Nice. Also, Rosalie Neko, hello. Thank you for the luck. I hope you have a a good luck. I hope you have a good day. Thank you for stopping in. And Bree, thank you for doing the, the backseating message as well. I, I should have done that. I always forget. Thank you. That That is why you have the sword. Thank you so much. <laughs> but I'm really excited to play more of this. I feel like I'm, a, I'm, I'm more on track now. Last week, I... I think I surprised myself by how I did not remember anything. Like, a little part of me had thought I was going to remember at least something. Like, like just a tiny bit, like a, a hint of recognition, but for, I, I don't remember it for some reason. I'm, it's like I've just blocked it out of my brain entirely, but that's kind of cool because it means it is basically a first playthrough. <laughs> I have no memory of playing this game, even though I know I have. The only thing that uh, having a terrible memory is good for. The, literally just playing games for the first time. <laughs> but yeah, last last time it took a while for me to actually get into, like, the thick of it. Like, I was just stuck on, like, the, the hub island, the, 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 the central island that links to the ages. Because I couldn't figure out what to do, simply because I... I didn't figure out I had to close the door of the elevator before I go up it. Like, that one tiny little aspect ended up taking me so long to figure out. But uh, because of that, it meant I got a, a really nice little look around the island. I got the lore dumps, getting the, the hang of how things work a little bit more. Wait, where's my cursor gone? Is it... Uh, oh, there. Okay. <laughs> But uh, yeah, last time I entered Ch Ch Channelwood. Is it Channelwood? I think it's Channelwood. And I think I probably ended the stream like right at the end of that area because I, I think I've gotten everything from there. I Unless there's like another secret little area that's going to happen now. I think I'm like at the end of the stuff I need to find in Channelwood, I think. So yeah, I'm going to load the game. Thank you very much. And we'll see where it where it drops me. See where it pops me down. When it loads. Yeah. Oh no, it is just right here. Yeah, this is this is like where I stopped. Because now all I need to do is I'm I'm pretty sure I just I don't know if there's more to explore beyond there, but I I just need to link the the water along to here. Oh, wait, I think I just missed the frog. Was the frog just here? 
I missed the frog. I didn't see the frog. I was so focused on the levers. No. <laughs> I can hear them, though. I can hear them. I love the frogs. Come on. I, I saw one last time. Come on. This, you got to be around here somewhere. It's okay. I'm, I'm sure I'll, I'll find the frog on the way back. But yeah, all I've got to do now is link the water up to there. So I guess the best way to do that, it would be like around this way. I might have to turn the water on again. Oh no, the water's still on. Okay, that's good. Right, so we want the water going this way. And then... going this way. And then going... Oh no, that's the wrong way. Wait. That's, that's just a dead end. No, I don't want it that way. This way. And now this should be powered so I can pull the lever. I think. Oh. Yes, look at that. There we go. This is this is the start I needed after last week. Now now it is just like yes, puzzle time, puzzle gaming. <laughs> well, the game really lives up to its name with it being so foggy. This is just like one age in it. I don't know if the other ones are going to be just as misty as this, but um, I said I was going to stop. I'm I'm not gonna stop. I will never stop. I'm sorry. But yeah, I think I found everything I needed to here. I got like the mysterious message from what's his name's son. I'm so bad with names. I'm really bad with names. I should write the names down. I need to like write the names of the characters down because the only one I remember is Catherine. <laughs> oh, and Dr. Anime, hello. Welcome, welcome. Welcome on in. Welcome to Mist Times. It is very misty at the moment. But yeah, from this area, I got the mysterious message from the sun. I got uh, I got a red page and a blue page, and I got half of a message, which, hold on, I did, yeah, I took the photo of that, yeah, I got half a message here, which is just like, plain view, missed access, easily, the simple follow instructions, first, locate switches on the island, I found all of those, I think. Uh, of these switches, we were able to dock, uh, turn the marker switcher off position, that might just be, I might be able to just... If it's just, like, go to the dock and turn the marker switch off. I might not even need the other half. <laughs> Depends on if there's going to be extra instructions. But we shall see. But yeah, I love that too. Like, the fact that the, the wood is darker because it's been submerged for so long. And you can see... Oh no, this is metal! Oh, it's metal! No, this walkway specifically is metal. But the rest of it is all wood. I guess that makes sense. Like, if it was made of wood and it was submerged for that long, it would probably just rot. <laughs> so it makes sense that they'd they'd make it like a like a metal one because of that. Oh, would it? <laughs> I think it would. Possibly. Also, Zariad, hello, welcome. Where cat? Cat here. Hi. <laughs> yeah, we are here in Channel Metal. Enjoying the the lovely walkways. Fish. I saw a fish. I saw like the silhouette of a fish then for a second. I swear. Over here. Ooh. What does this do? Can I turn it? I can. So I I can then connect the water over to here. Yes, so I'm going to have to connect the water to here to make this elevator go up. Okay, the last step. How do I get it around that way? Oh, that was your silhouette. Oh, now I'm even more sad I missed it. Come back. <laughs> Come back, I want to see. See your wonderful outline. <laughs> All right. I need it, like, all the way up here. I think this is the direction I need it to go in. 
So from here, we'll switch it this way. And then we have it going this way. Then we have it going this way. No, not that way. No, I keep it going this way. Okay. Keep it going this way. And then we have it go this way and that should do it. Yeah, that's the right pipe. That's going. That's going. Yes. Fabulous. Our oh, primal said hello. The rust turn noise is oddly musical, isn't it? It's got that lovely just it's 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 got it's a very melodic tune to it. I wish all rusty things would sound like that instead of horribly discordant. <laughs> but welcome, welcome. Okay, yes, we got this powered up. Oh, it's so sparkly. Oh, it's so pretty here. It is so pretty here. Look at this. I love this. It's like, oh, it really does feel so special. Did a good job with this age. A uh, man whose name begins with A that I've forgotten. Did a good job. Right, this time I closed the door. And we shall ascend. Also, Sunken Shell, hello. Welcome, welcome. Lovely to see you. Missed me? Haha. <laughs> I, I feel like... I am, I'm genuinely amazed at how many puns I'm managing to make from the word mist when it's all just the same word. Oh, is this going to be book to get back? This might be book to get back. Let's see. Let's see. Is this, is this book to get back? Yeah, honestly, I would love to live in that area. I, I feel like I'd be scared of living in the treetops. Yeah, I found a way back from Channelwood. Yes. I'm back to the library. Nice. Right. And I, I got more pages. So I'm, I'm going to just do this for now. I wonder if, like, the more pages I get, the clearer their voices will get because like it's it's becoming quite obvious that this is the two sons <laughs> like the two sons have gotten trapped in these books so now i'm like is it is it a good idea for me to be getting the pages who knows i'm gonna keep doing it anyway <laughs> but yeah here is the map of the island so now, last time, like, I activated the thing here, I activated the thing here, and I, how did I do this? Yeah, I did the, the tree. I managed to activate the thing here, which powered the tree up, which meant I could go to the channel wood through that. So I'm wondering, like, if, if, if one area links to another, like, when I solve this, that will be where I get to the age. When I solve this... Oh, would then be that be where I get to the age? Because it's the the dock and it was the the boat in the middle. And then this was like the gears, so it would be the gears. I want to check. I'm going to check because I managed to do the constellation puzzle and then I lifted this up. So I wonder if that... Oh, it has! Oh, it's lifted the, the boat here as well. Oh. Oh, okay. Oh, did you know? Why be sad when you can watch cat? So true. So true. Cats cats are pretty great. Not even talking about myself, just talking about cat cats and not cat girls. <laughs> Nothing else, the pages will make good emergency rations. Oh, I don't know if they have much nutritional value. I feel like it'd be better like eating the leaves off the trees at that point. But I don't know, they could make like toilet paper or something. <laughs> Right, so I've lifted this up now. Is this gonna have book? Maybe. Oh, can I go in here? <gasps> yes, okay, that has a book too. Okay. That's gonna be how I get to that area. <laughs> and then, is there gonna be a book here? Has this changed? Ooh. 
Yeah, there's a book. Okay. Okay. So I've I've found three of the books to get to three of the the ages. I just need to figure out the fourth one. It's just this horrible horrible voltage thing that I cannot figure out because I broke it. <laughs> Also, Everett, hello, welcome. Hope Mist is going well for me. It is now that I know what I'm doing a little bit more. Right, this I think is still, yeah, this is still broken. I don't know how to fix this. But uh, the one idea I had throughout the week, <laughs> the single thing I thought of all week when I was pondering over this game is that maybe it's, Maybe I can use these, like, maybe if I press both of them. Because I think what I've done is I've managed to pull, like, one of them and nothing happened, so I kind of left it. Well, I, I don't know if I've actually pulled them both at the same time. So I'm going to try that. <laughs> it, might, it might just continue to do nothing. I feel like it's not working because I broke all of the stuff, so I... And then the only other thing I can think of too is like maybe if I maybe if I like turn off the switch like reset it I don't know if that'll do anything though because from what I've been thinking and what I've been gathering and what I've taken in from when I looked over the VOD from last week I think those switches are just to like label on the map like, the things on the map didn't show up until I pulled the switch. So I think they may literally just be to, to mark the things on the map. I'm going to test it, actually. I want to I wanna see if I'm right. Let's see if this is... Yeah, look, that's not on the map anymore. I think, I think that's... It's literally just to show them on the map. <laughs> nice! Oh, I saw a little light from in here as well. Yeah, and look, it's back now. Oh, yes. I love having options. It's so good. What are my thoughts at this point on where the story's going? Well, I'm thinking it's going to be a situation of... Like, we, we know something has gone pretty wrong. Hold on, what exactly did the note say again? There. Yeah, oh, honestly, I should have realized by the fact they're called marker switches. They're literally marking the map. <laughs> that makes sense. Yeah, because what, what I'm thinking, like, the, the part we saw at the very start of the game with the book falling, uh, I don't think we're any of the, the named characters that we've been seeing. I think we just picked up this book. We picked up, like, the, the transportation book, and we ended up here because of that so now i think it's just going to be a case of like figuring out what's going on figuring out how to get out of here figuring out how to find a book that will let us out of here instead of like to the other ages but to do that like finding finding the pages i'm wondering mm, there's a there's a lot to think about <laughs> It's interesting theorizing about such an old game and, like, not knowing. Like, realizing I have no memory or, or knowledge of what's going on. Like, I'm thinking, like, the more pages we add, it's going to, like, complete the books. And then maybe they can become transportation books. But I feel like that's a bad idea. Like, if they're trapped in these books, then if I complete the books and then go in there myself there's nothing to stop me from being trapped too <laughs> i don't know <laughs> i mean it sounds like a terrible idea but it also sounds like the kind of thing i would try and do anyway but uh, i think like my best bet is literally just going to the different ages trying to get as many clues as i can trying to find as many pages as i can and then deciding after that because i've only been to Channelwood so far and it was interesting i got some interesting information from there got confirmation for sure that Cirrus is the one making a mess of things. I don't know if the other brother is also involved, but um, very possible, I think. Be interesting. Also, Tim, hello! Welcome, welcome! How's it going? Happy Sunday! 
Welcome to the land of mist. Helping Puzzle Cat. I mean, I may go to hell. Who knows? <laughs> but welcome, welcome. But yeah, I think like my best bet at the moment is I don't know how to like fix the voltage stuff here. So I, I have the other two areas though as well. Uh, am I okay with comments that compare the 2021 version to other versions? I think I will err on the side of caution and say I'd rather not unless it's something that I've actively done and then it's like, oh yeah, the original one was different in that specific spot. Yeah, yeah, if you whisper Brie, Brie knows like the <laughs> what would be like potentially spoilery or not. But yeah, it's, it, it's all like it depends on the situation because... If something is mentioned that then accidentally gives away something that I, I didn't realize, then that that means like I lose my opportunity to, to discover that thing. <laughs> oh, you're tummy heart survivor, Tim. Oh, I hope you feel better soon. I hope that the tummy heart goes away. Hopefully it eases soon. Just be strong. Think of how strong you are though. But yeah, I'm thinking the plan at the moment is I can either Either go to this area, which seems to be the one with the... Mention something about like a... Like an invasion. Oh, this one. This one is the one with the the gears. The gears and the cogs. So this one we were looking through. Yeah, this is... Yeah, the fortress. Yeah, this one mentions uh, learning to use the fortress. The enemy's coming. Here's the fortress. Here's how it works. The black ship. Yeah, so if I go to the mechanical age, I'm probably going to have to figure out how to work the fortress and fend off the enemies, question mark? Right, that's that's the one for the, the ship that I haven't figured out yet. Oh, the rocks. Yes, Emmett on the rocks. Yeah, this is going to be the boat one. There's the submersible lamp. We're frightened of the rain, the lighthouse. Oh, it might be lighthouse related. Ooh, and there's there's a map of the Stone Ship Age. You know what? I will take a photo of that. I I love the the option for just taking photos instead of having to make notes. It is very handy. But I feel like having a map is useful. Mind you, I say that. I took a photo of the map for Channelwood. I proceeded to not use it. I just ran around. <laughs> Oh yeah, and then there's all the constellations. Right, so I'm thinking I want to go on the boat first. Let's check it out. Oh, oh, it would actually spoil a puzzle. Okay, I'm. Thank you for asking before saying. <laughs> right, let's let's go here then. I'm I'm curious. To the rocks. Lighthouse. Yes, let's go. Let's see how this goes. <laughs> I don't remember if this one had a specific name. I think this one had a name of the area, but I've forgotten it. <laughs> I'll probably find something that will reveal it, though. Alright. Here I am. Oh, oh goodness. My ship appears to be sli oh slightly submerged. It's like in the, the journal. The journal was like, yes, I wrote them in a ship, but it appeared to get embedded in the rocks. <laughs> but they still had a fun time playing on it. Oh. I guess that's the tricky part. If you if you have this power to just create things by writing them, but it's like in an area full of rocks, you could just be like, yes, a ship magnificently appeared at this point. But if the rocks are there, it's going to appear like inside them. I don't know if there would be a way to... Oh. I don't know if there would be a way to, like, avoid that. Maybe you'd have to write an entire paragraph specifying that it managed to be miraculously in the water, away from any of the rocks. What is this? Hello. Oh. Oh. 
it did something. I don't know what that did, but um, th there's a lever there. And maybe I should look in here first. This feels like a logical direction to go in. That is full of water. This door is shut. This door is shut. Okay, maybe not this way. <laughs> See what's over here. Oh, look at this. Oh, it looks so lovely. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Like, just writing there was a tower. The tower could just appear anywhere. <laughs> Wait, is that a key? Something gonna happen if I take this? I don't know where this key has to go. But it's attached to a rope. Maybe I need to find something to cut the rope. So that I can move the key where I need it to be. Right, what's up here? Oh, I can't climb! There's rocks in the way! I, I can't get up there! Oh, that's where I need the key to be! Will it reach? It's not gonna reach, is it? Because of the, the rope. No, I need to cut that somehow. Hmm. Okay. Unless this is to control where the key is. Like, what if I do that? No, I feel like the noise is coming from, like, this way. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know exactly what that's, what that's doing. Oh! It's getting stormy. Nah, key's still in the same place. Still can't climb up there. Right, let's go along this way then. Hmm. Oop, in here. This is also submerged. Everything is submerged in water. Ah. It's okay, let's ascend. Oh, wow. Ooh. What do I need to look for? Oh. Okay. Don't know what I'm looking at, but... And 360, and then it's gonna go back to zero. Okay. So we have angles of various things here. So I will probably have to... find landmarks and remember interesting though hmm hmm Gotta say, and yes, you're referring to a meme. Uh, you work at the Triangle Factory and suddenly out of the machine comes a circle. What's my reaction? Uh, my my reaction to that would be, why is there a circle here? Move it out of the way. If it happens again, find someone higher up to talk to about it and make it someone else's problem. <laughs> uh, in the original 1993 version, the box came with an actual blank journal to write notes. I love that. I love that so much. That's so good. Like, I've still been writing some- Oh, hold on. This wasn't open before. How did I do that? Did I do that with that, maybe? Whoa. Yeah, I love that. I, lo I love making notes for everything. I've, I've still, even though there's the camera feature in the game, I've still been making notes the whole time. I've got my little notes of what voltage each button applies to. I've got my 59 volts, 724. Um, 240, 221. I've got it all written down in my, my physical notebook. Just because I really like writing notes. <laughs> I always like, whenever there's a puzzle that makes me have to get my notebook out, I'm just like, this is a good puzzle. This is a good time. 
But uh, I guess there's also the thing of like, you could just take screenshots if you wanted to. But uh, I'm, I'm far too lazy for that. <laughs> also, DCC rules. Hello, welcome. Yeah, that is so cool. I love the thought of that. I love when there are like versions of games that come with like specific things for the games. It's why I'm a big fan of like collector's editions. There's a lot of games when, whenever there's a collector's edition for a game I like. Oh. oh my goodness, I'm underwater. Look at the fish. So yeah, wh whenever there's a collector's edition of a game I really like, I will often buy it if like the things are good enough, even if I've already bought the game. <laughs> Just because I love, like, the additional extras and stuff. Like, I'm really excited because I've ordered the um, the Outer Wilds collector's thingy, which has got a bunch of stuff with it, including a kazoo. So I'm really excited for when that ships out. I'm just waiting because it, it was a pre-order thing. And they said, like, August, September. So it's, like, any time soon it could come out or it could be delayed. I'm just waiting for it. Oh, I love the fish. Oh, I wonder if the fish are going to be relevant somehow, like the patterns they're making. <laughs> oh, what is here? Oh, that feels like I'm going to be able to put something here. It's a little dark. Okay, I don't have anything to put here. But it's good knowing this is here. Ooh. Very interesting. Right, let's see what happens. I, I didn't mean to press spacebar. Okay, let's just take a photo of this one. I tried to jump instinctively. <laughs> when I was going up on the beam, I tried to jump and it was like, oh, you want to take a photo? Oh, I wonder if I do this... Am I going to be able to go under under the water here? Is it going to drain like the underwater here? And then this for like the third one, maybe. Maybe. Can I go down here? I can. Yes, that's what it is. Okay. Okay, I figured out what that does. All right. <laughs> oh, I love feeling smart. Oh, the music got intense. That's cool. It feels very regal. It feels very, very much like there might be a red page here, if you know what I mean. <laughs> hey, hey, what do you know? <laughs> what do you know? Nice. Let me grab that. What's in there? Yeah, we got knives again. It's, it's just like before, like the, the channel wood area with knives and cheese and stuff. But now there's like syringes and chemicals. And then I'm seeing that and I'm thinking that could be either peanuts or maggots. And I don't think I would want to take my chance. <laughs> right, what will happen if I press this? Ooh. Whoa, that's so cool. I want one of those things. I don't know what it is, but I want one. Oh, I can spin that. Ooh. Hmm. I can spin that. Ooh. I wonder if I have to like match them up. Somehow. Lovely bed. It's very luxurious. I feel like it says a lot about the characters, because, like, what I'm presuming are, like, the bedrooms for the brothers, for the sons, they are, like, way more luxurious and opulent than the dad's room, which is usually very, like, simple and straightforward. 
Like, I'm just presuming that the dad's room is the one that had the the creepy chanting orb in at uh, Channelwood. <laughs> but it was very, like, simple and not many luxuries and things. Whereas the son's ones were just like, yeah, we, we got all the fancy stuff. Oh. Yeah, look at this. There's so much. Coins? Why can't I take them? Wait, that's the symbol from the... The what's it called? The black flag? <laughs> oh, okay. Right, well, I found my red page. Let's get out of here. And let's go see if the other room will have a blue page. If my theory is correct. <laughs> Uh, boop, boop, boop. Drain that for me, please. Thank you. <laughs> yes, definitely Assassin's Creed. Oh, no, that didn't... Didn't drain there. Hmm. I guess that drained something else. Oh, maybe... Would it make a difference here? Oh, it did. It drained in here. Okay. I thought it was going to be the other room, but it's not. Oh. Is that a chest? Whoa, what is this? I don't know what I'm doing. Why am I letting the water out of that? Oh, is it going to be so I can... Okay, well, that's empty now. That has no water in it. If Oh, if I close this, I, I'm feeling smart. If I close this now that I've emptied all of the water out of it, when this fills up again with the water, this is going to float up because it's it's full of air now. And that should give the, the key enough slack for me to be able to actually put it in the keyhole and open the key. I think. I hope I'm right. <laughs> See, get that water back in there. Unless I have to move it to somewhere else. Let's just do that. Why not? Yeah, the, the thunder noises are really atmospheric, but they kind of terrify me a little bit. Right, so now that I've done this, will this reach? No. It's still, it gets stuck here, but now can I open, oh, I can use the key to open that. Open the chest, yes, and now I've got another key. You can go. To open this, to unlock the stairs. The ladder, oh yes, I feel smart, yes. Thank you for the head pad. <laughs> oh, this is a vast improvement on last week. <laughs> Okay, ooh. Don't know if I should have done that. Okay, it's flickering slightly. Before I touch that more, I'm... I'm scared. It's powering... Powering things here. Hmm. Interesting. Uh, the weather on the Age of Stone ship changed a lot over the versions. Originally, the day was somewhat misty. Later versions put you at night in the rain. Uh, the 2021 version introduced the, the sunset sunrise angles. That's interesting. Oh. Did it run out of power, maybe? Maybe? that That is scary. <laughs> that's scary. But that's so interesting, though. I'd love to, like, know after I finish the game, like, if there's, like, a developer's commentary on, like, why they decided to to do things differently. Because it's, like, it's it's the same developers doing, like, the, the remasters and stuff, isn't it? I think. I could be wrong. If I'm wrong, I apologize. Right, I think, yeah, this is going to, like, run out of power after a while. 
So we're not up to max, and I go. <laughs> Alright, so this is all lit up now, but because of the water being there, I can't do anything. I probably should have. It's flashing though, look! Oh, yeah, none of them are draining now. I didn't hear like the click for the water draining. So I wonder if that's different. Depending how things go. Can I see the, the lighthouse? There, I see it. It's really hard to control, like, the angle of this, because it seems to just be, like, wherever your mouse is. Okay, now it's flashing. At 1.35? I don't know if that's going to be relevant. I'm going to write it down anyway. 1.35. So I wonder if it's going to make... anything else look different. Because that was 1.20. Yeah, that's 1.35. Hmm. Interesting. I wonder what I need this power for. I can see it's connected. To all three of these areas. Like, it's turned the lights on here now, and the light was not on before? I don't know how to drain that. Oh no, it's because I didn't press the button. I just realized I'm so silly. It's because I didn't press the button. That's why the drain didn't happen. <laughs> Power ran out? Yep. Right, now that I remember how to actually do that, teehee. Let's go check what everything's like with the power on. Yeah, the company Cyan is the same, but some of the individual people have come and gone. Aw, oh, that makes sense. That makes sense. That's that's cool that Rand Mill is still in charge, though. It's always nice knowing, like, the original vision isn't getting lost. It's something that's always a little bit interesting when there are remakes of games, because sometimes the remakes end up being done by not the original team or the original developers. So it's always, like, there's always that wonder of, like, is anything going to be lost along the way? by somebody else being in charge. But I feel like a lot of remakes and remasters I've played have been like really well done. I think I need to go down here. I might not have enough time, but the power may turn off again before I can get all the way down. But we'll see. I don't even know if this will make a difference. I feel like I found most of the stuff I was interested in. Unless there is a specific thing where, like, maybe this will be different. This power. No, it still just wobbles. I love the music. <laughs> I love how they've managed to keep the music as, like, the MIDI music, but without it feeling really off. <laughs> so good. No, I don't know. I feel like going down there was for the page. Like, that felt... Felt like what I was going there for. I don't know. Alright, well, maybe this just does both of them? Oh, it does! It does both of them! Okay! Yeah, this is just for both of the chambers in the center, like this. I love that there are little drains everywhere because this place is just full of water. <laughs> Ooh. Okay. Yeah, see, this has a completely different vibe to the other room. <laughs> oh, and the lights are gone. The power's gone, even. There we go. Also, hello, Jack. Yes, it's not reading simulator this time. I've, I'm finally actually doing the puzzles. Welcome. And Suzume, thank you for the hydrate. Wait, that's actually the first hydrate of the stream. I haven't opened my monster yet. Here we go. 
Ah, oh, there we go. Can a monster at uh, 9.45 p.m., why not? Yep, this is an extremely different vibe to the last room. Ah, <laughs> oh, this has got all the... There's a lot of uh, tools here. What does this do? Change? Oh, now it's a skull. A rose and a skull. Okay. Various chemicals. Set of ribs. Oh, hold on. Oh, it's a candle. Oh, that is that is the the creepiest candle holder that I've ever seen, and I love it. That's cool. And this bed is so simple. Is there anything else in here? There has to be something else in here, I feel. This, this... Are these drawers? Oh, they're drawers! Oh, there's a blue page. There we go. Yep. Oh, are they maps? That looks like a map. Oh, it's the other half of my page! The vault is... Oh, the vault! So yeah, basically, with everything I got so far, I didn't need this half of the thing to figure it out if I just switched the one at the docks off. <laughs> okay, but I've got both of these now, that's great. Also, German guy, hello, welcome! Uh, welcome to the stream. I do not speak very much German, but uh, uh, willkommen, wie geht's? Uh, <laughs> Dankeschön. <laughs> Ich heiße Liri. That's about all the German I know, I'm, I'm afraid. But uh, welcome to the stream. Hope you enjoy your time here. I'm glad I have both sides of that now. Yeah, these are all maps. Yeah, I'm, I'm afraid I, do, I don't know <laughs> German. And this is an, an English chat stream, so... Uh, I don't allow other languages purely because of the fact that I don't speak them, so I, I don't know if people might say anything bad. <laughs> but uh, welcome in either way. I hope you enjoy your time here. I want to put it on the rose. The skull is weirding me out a bit. There we go. Right, so the impression I'm getting is that the one brother wants money and the other brother is um, joining a cult. I don't know. <laughs> they're, they're a little different, huh? Right, I've got, I've got the two pages, though. That feels good. That feels like good progress. Now I just need to figure out what I'm doing with uh, the, the power and... The, the numbers on here. If there's anything else I can do, because all I can do is like turn this at the moment. So we know the light is like exactly at 135. Hmm. But like the fact that there are like the, like on, on the mast here, there's the, the poles, that could literally just be part of a ship. It may not be relevant, but I keep looking at it. I wonder if there's anything else I missed. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna try drain that area again. I'm gonna drain the third part again. Where the lighthouse is. Let's get the water out of here. And... I wonder if anything will change down there when I turn the lights on. doing it all the way because I don't know what I'm actually looking for. <laughs> all right, and then... Is there anything else down here? I don't think there is. 
Like, everything I'm seeing feels like... Oh, actually, I have an idea. Back, like, where I saw the table, where it's like, it feels like there should be something here. I wonder if, like, when the power is on, something will be there, maybe. <laughs> Still nothing here, but there's a pipe. It's a pipe leading into the water. So what does that do? Why is that here? It doesn't seem like there are drawers. But I can definitely press something and it happens. I just don't don't have anything to put on there. Hmm. Hmm. Right, see, this feels so small. This area feels really small. So it seems like it should be easy enough to figure everything out. But I'm still clearly missing something. Hmm. Yeah, these are still powered up. I don't know if there's anything I can do with... these. Unless there's something along the way that I might have missed. Let's go try it. Bum, 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 bum. Because I did kind of just run down to the rooms at the very bottom. There could be something along the way that I've just been running past every time. So uh, let's get some power back. Once again. And see if I can figure out... Oh wait, actually, did I look like... Around the front? Okay, I don't think I can interact with that. But no, yeah, they both lead to those two. I'm just gonna do full power again. And go. And I will have a look. Because there were like other doors in the side at some point. Like, th there's loads of doors with like the grates at the bottom. <laughs> oh! Oh! Oh, I missed this. I missed this. There we go. Okay. Oh my goodness, buttons. Oh no. So north is going to be zero, right? I, I presume this is a compass. I'm guessing that's north. What did I write? 135. So, like, 180... Hmm. I feel like there. <laughs> oh, I feel like a genius. Oh, yes. Okay. I love that I just saw it. I was like, that's a compass. Where would 135 be? It'd be between 90 and 180. <laughs> Which button would that be? I can't believe I got that in the first push. The first button. The first button. I'm... I'm proud of myself for that one. I'm, I'm really proud of myself for that one. I'm, I'm, I'm giving myself a pat on the back for that one. I feel proud of myself. <laughs> oh, I'm glad I know angles. Okay. Well, that's, that's the way I came, I think. Let's see what's through here. Oh, does this lead around to the other way? Oh yeah, I think this just leads the other way, so you could access it from either. Nice. Oh, I'm... 
I am so proud of myself for that. <laughs> I'm so glad I wrote that down. I thought that I was like, oh, I don't know if I'm going to need this angle or not. But if I hadn't written that down in my notebook, I would have forgotten it. And I would have had to go back up to double check. <laughs> oh, but I... Okay, so with that, is that going to mean... Oh, I wonder if the book's going to appear down here. I didn't press the button again. I wonder. Yes. So it did feel like a podium for a book. Ooh. Yes, it is. Ah! I did it. Wow, that went way smoother than I expected it to. <laughs> oh, for that, I was I was getting so nervous for a second. Found a way back from Stone Ship. Yes, I was getting really nervous for a moment that I was going to get stuck on one thing, and be wandering around for an hour again. <laughs> I'm glad I found that. Oh my goodness. Oof. Oof. Oof, I did it. We got more pages. I'm just gonna, like, put them in there. I will add them to the book a little later, maybe. Maybe. When I decide what I'm doing. You know what? I'm actually gonna save. I don't save as often as I probably should in games like these. I feel like I should start making more save files. Right, so next, I guess... I guess the gears, I guess the mechanical age. Because I still haven't figured out how to do the, the ship. Let me have a look. May maybe something did change when I pulled the, the levers. I don't think it did though. I didn't, it didn't feel like anything changed. Oh wait, no, oh no, wait. Oh no, it did fix it. Oh, it did fix it. Now, oh, now, now I need my notes. Okay, so now 59 volts. Okay, I've written down what each of these buttons add up to. And it's, this one's 10, this is 7, this is 8, 16, 5, 1, 2, 22, 19, and 9. So I'm going to start with 22. And 19. So that makes 41. 8. 41. 41, 8, yes. 41, so then I need... 51. So I need 18 now. Oh, so 16 and 2? That's 59. I did it! Yes! What did I do to fix it? I pulled both of the levers outside. The ones that were like... Like you climb a ladder and pull the levers. I, I think like I tried pulling one and I tried pulling the other. I didn't try like pulling them both at the same time, but uh, I didn't think it had worked because there wasn't like a sound or anything, but I, I guess it did. Oh, so now we have the power, so now I can open the door for here. Ho, 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 ho. Door. Yes. The door is open. Oh, and I got the, there's a, the, 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 no, that's, okay, beautiful photo. I. <laughs> I wanted to view the photos. I've seen this. Here. 5143. Okay. Give me a second. I'm going to take a photo of this on my phone so I can have it right in front of me <laughs> while I'm figuring this out. Oh, this is going so smoothly. I'm so happy. I wasn't... Like, af after last week, I thought it was going to take me 500 years to do things. I'm glad I'm able to, like, redeem myself a bit. <laughs> It's like, yes, I am back on form now. Okay, so I've got the notes. I'm ready to play piano with my additional beautiful photos that I took by accident. Oh, look at that. Magnificent. I'm so glad I took that. This is great. Oh, there's, there's so many things I wanna press. All right, piano time. I'm 
I'm doing this so slowly. Yeah? No? Maybe not? Do I have to press them for longer, maybe? One, two, three, four, five. Maybe not. Hmm. Hmm, maybe I'm missing something else. <laughs> piano redeem. <laughs> Time for me to play the piano. Oh, this is this is more like an organ though. This is an organ. It's got the pipes. Oh, maybe I have to do something here first. Oh, oh wait. I'm, I have to. Rem oh my goodness. Okay, okay. I can do this. I've got a good ear. Bye. I think it's that one. Bah. Bah. Yeah, that's the same one. Okay. So we got bah. And the next one is like the same but higher. Bah, bah. Okay, okay, first two. Third one. It's gonna be... <laughs> that's right, right? Yeah, that's right, okay, a fourth. Fourth one is... Da, ba, 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 ba. Ah. Ah. Yes. And the last one is this one. Ba, ah. Ah. Ba. I think that's right. Double check. Yeah, that's the one. Okay. One of the times when having near perfect pitch comes in handy. <laughs> that's the one. Oh yeah. Okay. Okay, I've got all the books now. I've got all the books available. So do I want to go to Gears or do I want to go to... I mean, I'm kind, I'm, I'm, I'm kind of in the spaceship. I kind of just want to. No, I'm gonna do the gears first because I unlock two gears first. <laughs> I'll save the ship until last. Let's go over here. Okay, mechanical age. <laughs> Yeah, this is more like it. I'm actually doing it now. <laughs> oh, it's so funny looking back, though, on last week's stream. Like, the fact that I got so stuck for so long, purely because I didn't shut the door of the elevator. I d oh, this is so cool. Hello. Ooh. Oh. Buttons. Probably shouldn't be pressing them yet, but... But the buttons. I wonder what the, the symbols are. Is this like half circle? That. Loads of different shapes. Okay. All right. Yeah, exactly. Last week was the law stream. Last week was um, getting to know uh, the backstory. And that was definitely intentional and not because I got stuck. Uh, definitely meant to do that. 
You're right. <laughs> right, what's in here? Ooh. I'm gonna get lost in here. I can tell. I can just tell. The music. Oh, look at that. Clock says just past three. What's in here? Can I look? Oh, I wanted to look through the, the spyglass. Okay. Oh, well, crystals. Okay, I love these dice. That's great. Uh, I don't know if I should just have like a specific one lit or something. I'm just gonna keep them all lit up for now because they look cool. Oh, hello. Oh, this really is the mechanical age. There's all these mechanical things. Oh, please tell me I don't have to play chess. Oh, thank goodness. Okay, button. Ooh. Secret, secret compartment with a note. Oh. Cyrus, your greed sickens me. Your desire for wealth and plunder is never satisfied. I will instruct my subjects not to pay your new tax, and you know they'll listen to me. Regards, Akana. Okay. I think I may have actually been right on the cult thing. <laughs> so, you know, Cyrus is greedy and wants all wealth, and Akana probably has started a cult. Uh, <laughs> maybe. But it sounds like they weren't pretty good friends with each other. It, it seemed like they was they got along so nicely when they were younger. But I guess as they got older, their preferences changed. Anyway, red page. So I'm guessing Akinar is the red pages. Oh no, is Cirrus the red pages? No, yeah, because this is two Cirrus. Yeah, Cirrus is the red pages and Akinar is going to be the blue pages, I think. What happens if I press that button? Oh, I shut myself in here. That's nice. I don't know what I expected to happen. <laughs> I don't know what I thought would happen. Okay. Right, that adds up. He would be the type to give himself a throne. Right, if I go around the other way now... Okay, there's an elevator there. Yeah, this is going to be Akana's room. And yeah, this it has a slightly different feel to it compared to the other one. Huh. Oh. Oh god. Oh god, that <laughs> That made me jump so much. That's embarrassing. Oh, okay. Yay. Thanks, that was great. I expected it to be a jack-in-the-box of some sort. I was not expecting the snake. Oh, hello. Rotation simulator. Oh, we can rotate things. Okay, let's... Can I rotate? Rotate. It won't go very far. That one just... Oh! I don't know where I need to rotate it to, so I should probably leave that for now. Yeah, that's wrong. I get it. I, I don't know what I'm doing. Oh! Oh, but here's the secret compartment here. Th this looks lovely. This looks so great and wonderful. Great. Love it. Thanks, Akana. That's... Yep. Yeah. Yep. Can I open this? No, it's locked. Oh, what happens if I pull this, though? Oh, whoa! Dude, what was he doing? Yo, okay! Um, I will, um, let myself out of here, I think. <laughs> oh my goodness, they're both awful. They've both lost it. This is... This is bad. Huh. Hmm. 
Okay, um... Well, I guess it's time to check out that elevator I saw after those lovely, lovely rooms. Can I enter? There's no power. How do I make that work? You know what? Let's let's go outside. I did just walk straight in here. Hopefully there's something else around. Right, well that was that was lovely. I, I feel like there's gotta be a way to move this. Like to move the walkway. Is it gonna be this? To do with these maybe. I don't know what symbols I need. I must hunt for more clues. Yeah, you know what? I'm going this way first. At least this one doesn't have an electroshock torture cell. <laughs> okay. You're very cute. Oh, maybe this is related? No, they don't have like... Oh, maybe like the number of sides they have. Like that one has eight sides, that one has like... I don't know. I don't know how many sides they have, I can't count. I don't know what maths is. That one's a uh, few minutes past three on the clock. There is boat, there is rocket ship. Bars, all the paintings on the walls. Hmm. Whoa, that- I, I didn't pay much attention to this photo until now, th this painting. This is actually incredibly cool. That's a very cool painting. Oh, could it be something to do with like the back of here? Maybe, maybe not. Hmm. Oh, there's, there's little cables. Little cables attached to everything. Is there something... In this... No. I, I want to press the button. Button. Thank you. No, they, they, they probably just connect to that button. Like, yeah, it's just like loads of wine and money. <laughs> He just has gold and wealth. I don't see anything else in here. Yep, nobody's gonna pay the new tax, Cyrus. Hmm. Oh, button? Okay, okay, I didn't spot that button the first time. Okay. Oh. Do I need to make it like match up? Like that? Yeah, I heard something. Okay, it's it's lined up. So now if I Yes, it's open. Yes. Okay. And this one seems to be mechanical, so I don't have to shut the door. It shuts the door itself. Thank goodness. Thank goodness. I'm so bad at that. <laughs> okay. I love the massive gears in this. I've got to say, like, there's something so aesthetically cool about giant gears, I think. Oh, I can't seem to do anything else here, though. It's so quiet as well. No. Okay. Hmm. Can I go up? Can I go further up? No? Oh! I don't know what that did. Okay. I'm in the middle? Can 
Can I get out? No, there's probably just a wall there. Why am I in the middle? Um, why will it let me do that? I don't know. There's probably a reason for it. Hmm. I wonder if there's a way I can send it there without going myself. No, I, d I think it'll like put me in the elevator if I do that. Oh, what? Oh, button this side. Oh, it just does that. Okay, so I'm... Never mind. Oh no, wait! Whoa! Oh, maybe- no, maybe not. What happens if I go up? The walkway different. Maybe something will change? No, maybe not. I'm so curious as to why there's this middle button. It feels like there has to be a reason for it. For it to just stop in the middle like this. I don't really see anything though. Hmm. Alright, let's go back out. What I'm gonna do is, it had like the semicircle with a gap at the bottom. Like the circle with a little break in the bottom as the symbol I had to match up there. So I wonder if I just put that symbol in on the machine thingy over here, if something will happen. <laughs> That's my current plan. Because at the moment, it's just the pluses. But if I make it all that symbol, maybe something will change. No, okay. It was worth a try. Oh, what's, what's that on the top? Wait, is that, is that a bird? Is that a bird on the top? I can't tell. Hmm. Okay, there's nothing else back there. Yeah, I guess... It's gonna be something to do with these... glowing shapes. anything out there or something to do with like the the rotation thing oh maybe if i can figure out how this works maybe i can rotate the thing and that'll move the bridge i think that's what i have to do i think i might have to like line it up to one of the the triangles Oh, but it's running out of power before it can get anywhere. So does, does this, like... Hmm. Oh, that speeds it up. Oh! There? I don't know what I'm doing with this. Huh. It made a sound. Made a sound. Made a sound. I'm gonna stop. Oh, and it's gone. Okay. It made a sound there, though. What What does that sound mean? I think I did something. But I'm not sure what. But then it, like, buzzed and didn't work again. So what am I missing here? Yeah, the steampunk age. Honestly, like, the thing I like the most about steampunk is just, like... Having loads of cogs attached to everything, like, it doesn't make sense to just stick cogs on things, but I love them. I think cogs are cool. <laughs> oh, what am I missing here? How does this work? See, yeah, it's just rotation simulator. What? I don't understand it, because it's like, this... I think this is like the amount of power I give it. And then this makes it go. I don't know. Hmm. Like that. <laughs> Made a noise. Do I just keep doing this? That 
made a ding? Okay. It's like a hiss, a ding, an insect. And that's the last one. Clang. Okay. Clank, hiss, ding, insect. That's what I'm writing down. <laughs> Clang, hiss, ding, insect. Those are the sounds for each of the points on here. I don't know what they mean. Maybe I have to do them in a specific order? Maybe something else? Who knows? But are they each made a specific noise? Oh, that's the hiss. No, that's a different hiss. Hmm. Hmm. There's a lot of stuff in here. Hum. I'm gonna I'm gonna have a look at something over here no I, d I don't know if I'd be able to like match up the sounds to these symbols I haven't found anything that would give me that but uh what if I just okay No, it's just the same noise, like, just saying it's wrong. Okay. Oh, can I look like... Oh, look at that. Also, Thermo, hello! Welcome, welcome. G -g Greetings to you too. How's it going? The game that defined your mid-90s. I love it. Uh, I'm doing pretty well so far. I'm doing much better than I did last week. <laughs> but, the oh, it's such a pretty view. Uh, I'm a little bit stuck at the moment in the mechanical age. I'm figuring things out. I've got a bunch of sounds. I've got both of the pages. I've got the, the red and the blue page from here. I'm just trying to figure out anything else. <laughs> but welcome, welcome. It's so nice. What am I doing with these? Like, I feel like there's a reason they have buttons. It can't just be to make them look pretty. Surely. Maybe it is. Maybe it is just to make them look pretty. <laughs> but no, it's like I've I've written down clank, hiss, ding, insect for the sounds that the thing made. <laughs> but I don't know what, re what that's going to be like with anything else. Oh, what am I doing? Also, Panda Man, hello! Thank you for the headpad! Welcome, welcome! How's it going? Oh, oh, by the way, since you'll see the pretty version on stream anyway, you picked OG Riven and played a little of it so far. Oh, I hope you're enjoying it! See, Riven I never played. I, I have memories of owning this game, but I never played Riven. So, I was gonna say, like, so that'll be a completely new experience. This feels like a completely new experience to me, to be totally honest. I don't remember anything. But it's so fun. I wish I could look through this. Can't change the time. Hmm. Make a little bird noise, it's so nice. What if I what if I keep doing that? No. Okay, um, Hmm. Let me go outside and think about it in the fresh air. Is there anything I've missed around here? Oh, it's like pink down there. You see, I'm guessing what I have to do is get over there. And to do that, I'm going to have to rotate this. And to rotate this, I'm guessing I have the, I have like the simulator in Akinar's room. But I still can't quite figure out how this works. 
Very interesting. So I can do that. Because there, that was the hiss. But then it just buzzes and goes off. Get it, I walked away from you, you're buzzing. Oh, I'm actually racking your brain trying to remember what needs to happen here. <laughs> yeah, I'm I have no idea what I'm doing. I'm just gonna try and do my best to <laughs> to be observant. To try and be observant. As observant as I can be. Right, I'm going up here again. And I'm gonna do the middle button again, because there there has to be a reason for it. It's like, I can go up? This is here, but this is blocked and there's a big cog in the way. But then there's a button that's like the middle. It makes a little alarm go off. Oh, what if I step out and then it goes down? Maybe there'll be something on top of it. Oh, that's exactly it. Oh, oh, okay. That's what I was missing. That's what I was missing. It was just that sudden moment where I was like, oh, and the alarm's going off. Wait, I could get out. I could step out of it right now, and then it would just go. <gasps> okay, now what? Okay. Oh, so this is the simulator. So I need to remember how to do it. Should have paid. Oh, it dinged, it dinged, it dinged. I moved it. I moved it. I think. I think I moved it. I think I remembered it enough. I'm trained for this. I, I know what I'm doing. I think I may have turned it the wrong way. We will soon find out. If I have, I know how to get back. It's fine. <laughs> I may have turned it the wrong way and then I just have to do a full 180 degrees, but uh, we'll see. We shall see. Oh, now this machine makes so much sense. It was training me. It was training me on how to move things. Oh, no, I did. I did turn it the right way. Oh, yes. Okay. Ooh. Curvy thing and triangle, rectangle, triangle. Let me write that down. So I've got half of the code. Now I need the other half of the code. Which I will guess... Which I'm guessing I will get if I turn it again? Yes, maybe. Let's see. Oh, right, I want to do the simulator again, actually. I want to figure out if I can do it, like, perfectly. So I don't have to adjust it. Right, so if I do, like... Like there. Oh, I just do it like that, that's fine. Yeah, this is fine. I know what I'm doing now. Photo album time. No, I'm I'm just manually writing this one down. <laughs> I'm like, I don't need to take a photo of that. I can draw in my notebook very badly. And now, send that down. Oh, oh, I, oh, see, this is one of the nice things about streaming. Like I start saying out loud what I'm doing and as I'm saying it out loud, I realize what I'm missing. <laughs> it's like the, the rubber duck programming technique. All right, so that's like there. Let's turn you again. That's not enough. A bit more. No, I went all the way back. Okay. 
keep going. I need to be patient. Okay, okay. Got the ding. This might be the wrong spot. I turned it quite a lot. This might be the wrong spot. We will soon find out. <laughs> it's okay. I'm here all night. I can take as long as I like with this. Also, Ted's a Bentley. Hello. Welcome, welcome. How's it going? I hope you're doing well. Uh, I just discovered how things work and I feel proud of myself. <laughs> Yeah, it's, it's really, it really is such a good strategy. It's a really good way of figuring things out. Like, trying to explain it to somebody else. No, this is the same spot. I, I did, like, a full circle. I should have noticed that. It's okay. Now I know. I need to, I think I need to judge by the cogs. Like, the gaps in the cogs. Like, obviously, it'll be a full rotation when the circles line up. But then, like, I can use each circle of the cog to know how far around I've moved it. But yeah, it's a really good way of figuring things out. Because sometimes you don't even realize what you're missing until you start saying it. And then you're like, wait. Oh, yeah, actually, I know exactly what I got to do now. <laughs> right, so, like... This is the spot at the moment. Like, we'll use the circle as a guide. I need to get this circle to there. So I'll do that. Go like that. Wait till the circle's like there. It's going back a bit. A bit further. A bit further again, because it's going to go back again. Now that went too far, I think. Oh, it dinged, it dinged. No, that might not be too far. I heard a ding. I heard a ding. I'm hoping that's good. I'm hoping the ding is what I need. So what was the ding? Yeah, the ding was a different direction. <laughs> Because the ding was the west one. I don't actually know which way I need to go, but ding was west. And that's a direction I haven't looked in yet, so... Oh no, okay, ding is where we start. We start at ding. Okay, so we start in the west. That's good to know. I can probably actually figure things out a bit smarter. Right, I haven't been there. So if that's the west, I need to go south. I need south, so... I need the clang. <laughs> I need the clang. I'm listening for a, an enormous clanging sound. <laughs> and that's the direction I need to go, I think. It could be the same place again and I'm just silly, but we'll find out. I need to keep going until I hear a clang. Haha. <laughs> Lum, lum, lum. And we'll go. That's the hiss? Okay, I don't want the hiss. I need the clang. Oh, wait, hold on. I think, no, I think the ding was north. Hold on. Yep. Yeah. South, east, north, west. Okay, so the ding was north. So we start at the north. So I actually need west, which is the insect noise. I need the insect noise. So we keep going. That's the ding. I don't need that. I need an insect noise. There, there's the insect noise. Okay, I think this is the one I need. 
I think this is the one I need. We'll see. We'll see if this is right. Also, yeah, each world getting the pages is easy and then the real puzzle is getting back out. That's like the, the ongoing theme so far. Like, finding the pages is really straightforward, but actually getting out, that's, that's where you've got to start thinking. Oh, I'm just so sad I can't like look. Wait, oh, hold on. Huh? Hello, what? a little skeleton. Wait, I didn't see anything before on that. I was running back here to say I'm so sad I can't like see anything. Okay, it's not the insect then. It is the opposite of the insect. Okay, I've, I just got my cardinal directions wrong. It's fine. It's fine because it means it's the opposite of the insect. The opposite of the insect is the hiss. Oh, so I did have it. <laughs> I need the hiss sound. There's the hiss. Okay, I think I think it should be this one. It might not be. I might be going to every single one except for the one I need, but uh, we'll see. We'll see. Oh, I'm so thankful for that. Uh, the um, the little um. What am I saying? I'm, I'm so thankful for the little uh, test device, the simulator thing. I love how I was like, I don't understand this. I don't know how this works. And then as soon as I saw that thing, I was like, suddenly I understand everything. Yes, and I made it. This is the right one. Also, yes, Thermo, I will be uploading the VODs. Um, they'll be on Twitch until like they time out and get auto deleted. But I always upload all of my VODs to my YouTube channel. So uh, if, if you want to view any past VODs of games I've played, they're all on my YouTube. Um, except for, like, I'm a little delayed at the moment with uploading, like, the past week's VODs. I think the missed one is the last one I have uploaded at the moment, because I'm, I'm a little delayed on it. I'm going to be scheduling them up to catch up soon, hopefully. But uh, it's been a bit of a, 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 a time recently. I've been extremely busy, and I keep forgetting to actually update the VODs. <laughs> So they will be there eventually. It just might take a little bit to catch up. But yeah, I think if you do exclamation point YouTube, it might link my channel. Let me test. It does! There it is! There's the link directly to my channel. It's got every VOD for everything I've done, except for the stuff that has been copyright stricken. <laughs> Oh, the first one looks like Sonic about to lose his rings. It does. There we go. We got the circle with the spikes and then we got the half circle. I've got all four now. So now I just need to head back to the ding. It, I think it was the ding. I think it was the ding. Where's that skeleton? I saw a skeleton through the spyglass over here. Where, where is it? Maybe on one of the other ones. Let me have a look. Oh yeah, there's nothing there that time. Okay. All right, let's go home. Hopefully. And by home, I mean the main mist island. <laughs> also, Fred, hello. Welcome, welcome. Yes, don't forget to drop a like, smash that subscribe button, and whack the bell on the head. I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, honestly, um, I 
I mostly have my YouTube as a way to keep my VODs because Twitch doesn't really give an easy way to keep VODs. It just auto deletes them. And I wanted them all available because a lot of the time people are like, oh, I'd love to see you play this game. And I'll be like, ah, I actually played that two years ago. You can check it out. <laughs> okay, but I need, I need the ding. The ding of the notification bell so you never miss a video, am I right? <laughs> That one, there it is. Haha. -ha. Uh, you just highlight the entire VOD. Yeah, I guess you could do that. But uh, I, I feel like YouTube is an easier platform for videos. Like, I much prefer Twitch for live streaming. I, I think Twitch has so many things for streaming that YouTube really does not have yet. But when it comes to like, just actual watching videos and stuff, um, YouTube is so much easier. Like, watching bods on Twitch is not the greatest experience. <laughs> it's definitely more about the, the live stuff. Oh no, this, is, this isn't the ding. Wait. Which way is home then? I don't remember which way is home. <laughs> Uh-oh. Maybe it was the clang. Maybe it was the clang and not the ding. We'll see you. But yeah, I, I mostly just prefer watching videos on YouTube, so I... It's just nice to have, like, a place to keep all the VODs. But uh, I do plan on uploading some non-VOD videos to YouTube soon in the future. Wink wink. Uh, things to look forward to. Uh, <laughs> things planning that I've been planning for, like, three years and still not done. Don't worry about it. Also, oh, hey, day, hello. Mist always felt intimidating. How have I been liking it? I'm really enjoying it, honestly. Uh, I got very stuck for a while. It took me a while to actually figure out what I was doing, but now that I know what I'm doing, I feel like I've gotten the hang of it a lot more. Okay, maybe it was the clang. Maybe this is home. <laughs> but no, I, it's been so good, though. Uh, the first stream was basically just an extended law session where I was reading all the journals, but now I'm actually doing the puzzles. <laughs> but it's so fun. Yeah, my biggest enemy is doors. I don't know how to open and close doors. Yes, okay. Okay, I'm back. I'm back and I've got the code. I have the code. I've got the code, and it is... Where is my notebook? It is... Upside down, circle with a gap. Triangles and rectangle in the middle, that one. Uh, Sonic about to die. Yep, and... Semicircle. Yes. <gasps> Look at that! Yes! I did it! And we found the book. Let's get out of here. That was fun. But yeah, I got both of the pages. I'm ready to go back. So with that, I only have one more age I have to check. So the, que uh, the question is, do I want to start putting these pages in the book? before I go to the last stage. The last stage? You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna save. I'm gonna make a new save file. And I want to. I want to see if things get clearer as I add more pages, because I think that's gonna be the case. Like, if I do that... Let's see. Oh, sorry. I just closed it on him. Hi. Return. Yep. You're welcome, I guess. You must continue. I must, must I? My name is Sirius. Yeah, this is Sirius. This is the the rich asshole. <laughs> I beg you, find the remaining pages. You must. I must. I I get it. Okay. 
Not sure if I want to, honestly. And then over here, let's let's just put one of the the blue ones in. And this is gonna be Akana. Let's see. You returned. You wouldn't return. Ages to rescue me. <laughs> I'm Akana. Yeah, he's Akana. My brother, I beg you. Always oh, blue pages. Well, he sounds fine. He sounds okay. And definitely doing all right. Uh, he... I, I don't trust either of them. I don't trust either of them. I don't think I actually want to give them these pages. I'm... <laughs> I'm here like, I don't want to give either of them these pages. Like, we know that this guy is just obsessed with money and wealth and opulence and doesn't give a crap about anyone else. And this guy probably started a cult, probably started numerous cults knowing him. And he does not sound okay. He sounds like he's been through stuff and he's not dealing with it well. So I... Mm. I'm going to go fly a ship. Oh wait, do I want to try flipping the switch down at the dock? Because I got the note that was like, have all the marker switches on and then turn off the one at the dock. So I kind of want to try that. See what this vault is. Ooh. White page. Oh. Oh, I got a white page. Okay. All right. Ooh. Put it back on. Ooh. The white page. <laughs> now nah, the vibes from both of them are totally trustworthy. Yeah, everything I've seen about those two guys tells me they are completely stable and trustworthy and are not probably going to murder me in my sleep. <laughs> Alright, let's, let's go here then. I think this is the last age. Last age, here we go. Also, Phelan, hello, welcome. Welcome on in, welcome to, um, I'm actually doing the puzzles in Mist now. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Probably just went through a rough patch. And, and just, yeah, I, <laughs> I can fix them. <laughs> Yeah, I'm, like, the stuff I've seen makes me think that I probably should not be finding all of the pages for them. But I'm going to continue to do it anyway. Because... Why not? Oh, oh do I remember the tune? Pretty sure that was the tune, but... I don't know. Right, what? Oh, button! Ooh. It is so misty here. It is so misty. Oh my goodness. Also, Thermo, you are so right. This is just an isekai game. This is like... <laughs> the, the origin of isekai. Just get isekai'd into various different ages. That's so funny. Uh, no, no hints. I'm not going to mention anything other than this was your first video game ever. Oh, nice. Nice. I, I know I played it many, many years ago, but I genuinely don't remember it at all. It's I'm So I'm basically playing it for the first time now. And it is such a cool adventure. I am having so much fun. I feel like the world building really makes it. Like the, I'm, I'm curious about what's going on with the... With like the linking books and the different ages and stuff. Oh, is this gonna be sound related? that because I didn't change half of them. Hmm. I, 
think I'm gonna have to find sounds. Can you stop? It's not gonna stop now, I don't think. I think I broke it. That's okay. I will just not go there. Oh, this place is so pretty though. I really love like this kind of atmosphere where it's just like trees in the mist at like late at night. It's got the waterfall going. This is so lovely. This I I love this. Like if I knew there was nobody else around and I didn't have to fear like uh, my life being taken, I would love to just be in a place like this in the middle of the night. Just lie back and relax and listen to the the sounds of nature, look at the trees. This is so lovely. This is my favorite so far, I think. I love this. Ooh. Blue page? Blue page. Oh, they're water droplets. Huh. Do I need to make water droplets? Or the sound of water droplets? Maybe the- yeah, this might be one of the sounds that I need. So I need the sound of water. I'm gonna write that down. The sound of water. And it's super mysterious as well. It's so cool. Alright, so this- this is definitely, uh, the sound of water. something i don't know all right is there gonna be another sound here oh yep that is the sound of warm air emerging from a crevice in the ground <laughs> i guess a whole world of sound puzzles it sounds like like the best thing to me i love sound puzzles i love things that involve like tune and tone and pitch and stuff i'm i love sound related stuff but I, I i'm also like a very musical person so like i feel like it's not the kind of thing that everyone would enjoy but that's something i do really like about this as well because if you struggle with sound prompts and stuff there is actually an option in the settings to display uh, gameplay context subtitles and when you do this it will come up with like little labels saying things like sound of water flowing or like, let's see, like if I enable it here, yeah, look, lava rumbling, it labels it all for you. So if you struggle to make out sounds and stuff, you can, you can have the subtitles to help, which I think is really good. I love when there's nice accessibility stuff like that. Makes me happy to see. I, oh, clock. Clock ticking. Yep, clock ticking. I have no idea what order these are going to need to be in, but I'm just going to write them all down. Clock tick. Wrote that down. Yeah, oh, in, in the first several versions, Mist 1 imposed an inventory maximum of one page. Oh, so you had to, like, go back and forth to drop the pages off. I, I guess that wouldn't be too bad, considering you kind of have to link back to the library when you leave an area. Oh no, wait, but if there's a red and a blue in each area, oh no, you'd have to go in twice then. Oh yeah, I could see how that would be a little annoying. So you'd have to do each area twice then, pretty much. Although I guess it would be easier the second time around. What is... Is this the sound of crystals? Yeah, this is crystal sound and a red page. Crystal resonance. Nice, let me write down crystal. And then I'm guessing the last one's gonna be up this way. Yeah, down here. Uh, 
uh, uh, I'm going to call that one falling down a hole. Falling down hole. Okay, so I've got five sounds now. But there's also a ladder and I'm going down. I see a ladder, I'm going down it. There's no way I'm not <laughs> going down it. Oh, what does that this do? Oh, lights! <gasps> and that's... Caves. Oh, and I can go up here. Where does this lead? I'm in the middle now. Okay. So that's gonna be the order I have to put them in, I guess. Oh, it's so loud. I went in that exact order. This order on here is the exact order I wrote it down in. That is so funny. That's so funny. I didn't mean to take a photo, it's fine. I can't believe I did it in the right order. <laughs> well, it just kind of made sense, like walking around the island. It made logical sense to go in that order. Oh, did I just turn the lights off? I want them on, please, thank you. Through the cave, up to the other side, and now I can put all the sounds in. Back I go. Oh, I'm so glad that's something that they didn't continue with the pages. Like, that you can take both of the pages. Because, <laughs> like, I'm, I'm going to be getting them anyway. I guess it'd be more like you have to just, like, pick one and stick to it. Right, here we go. Okay, the first one. This one needs to be the water. There's the water. Okay. We got the first one. Next one is the lava. The lava coming out of the ground. That's the crystal one. Is that the lava or is that the falling down a hole? I don't know, I'm gonna put it as that for now anyway. Next is the clock ticking. That's the falling down a hole one. Is that the clock ticking? It doesn't sound like it. No, that's the clock one, I think. And then next is the crystals. There's the crystals, and then it's falling down a hole. That's falling down a hole. I think this is right now. So I'm going to do that. And... Do I go back now? Now that I've done that, I wonder if this will react in the middle now? Now that I've sent that across? There might be something else I need to do as well. We will see. <laughs> but I think I got that right. Uh, I hope I did. If I didn't, then I, I guess I'll go back and fix it. But I think that should be right. Question is just if I need to do more over here. I 
didn't mean to take a photo then. I'm not sure what I have to do. It doesn't seem to be like connecting. Unless I had to set it up with this ahead of time. So it starts trying to detect it. Okay, it's just gone to lava. Is that because I clicked on that one? Maybe. Um. Hmm. Unless it is a different order. Oh, it might be a different order judging by the pictures. So, water, lava, that, that, that. Okay. So first is that, then it's water. I don't remember any of these. It's something water, something, something clock. Okay, I've got them the wrong order. I have the wrong order. Something water, something, something clock. So the lava one has like a rock at the bottom. The crystal one, you can kind of see the crystals. That one is just fog. All right, so let's do it again. So it's crystals first, then it's the water, then it's the falling down a hole, then it's lava, then it's clock. Okay, okay, I got it. I got it, I think. <laughs> uh, I, I got... I got so excited about the buttons being in the order I'd seen them in. I should have known it wouldn't be that straightforward. <laughs> I should have known, but it's okay. I got it now. I got it now. I got the order. And I'm pretty sure I do remember the sounds pretty accurately. Like I can tell the difference between the lava and falling down a hole. <laughs> right, let's try this again. All right, so first is the crystals. Second is the water. Third is falling down a hole. Fourth is lava. It sounds more like a cassette player. No, I guess that is the clock. Okay, so... I think that's right, unless these are gonna have to be swapped over because the cables are the opposite way around. Who knows? Let's see what happens if I do that. No, it worked. No, it worked. Okay, that was right. Yes. Okay. I made it. I'm in. Oh, deeper in the caves. Ooh. Okay. Okay, here we go. Descending to the depths. What is in here? I did it. I, I love sound puzzles. <laughs> I feel like everyone I talk to always talks about how much they hate like sound puzzles in games and things that rely on sound and I'm just like the odd one out in the corner like I, I love the sounds I love to listen to things <laughs> right I'm guessing that's not just gonna open oh no it does okay <gasps> controls to where 
What am I doing? Where am I going? I'm gonna have a wander first. Okay, I don't think there's anything around here. <laughs> okay, never mind. I guess I'm just um piloting the ship. I don't see how this can go wrong at all. Um button. Okay. Uh oh. Okay, I'm down. I am going very far down. That is very loud. <laughs> okay. Okay. Ding. Okay, I don't know what the ding's for. Uh, go forward? Yeah, I guess I go forward. There's no other way to go. That made an insect noise. I feel like I need to remember this. I'm gonna make a note of the noises I hear. Considering how much sound stuff there is here, I think I need to remember the noises. So, ding. Insect. I'm just gonna, like, write them down as I hear them. <laughs> uh, for you, you had to grow into your love for sound puzzles. As a child, you disliked them so much. When you grew up and became a musician, figuring out songs from the radio with no YouTube is pretty much the hardest sound puzzle. Oh, it really is. Especially, like, when you can't get the lyrics. To look up the lyrics. Right, I guess I just keep going? There's something up there. Oh, it's like a door. Can I go out here? I cannot. Okay. So do I have to turn? Okay, I turn to the right. Oh, is, is this going to be, like, a maze? Am I going to have to, like, map out my track? I feel like I should. Okay, insect. I'm going right from what I see. I'm going northeast. Oh, it's like northeast. Okay, I'm going that way. I'm going to draw myself a map as I do this. Let's go this way. Okay, no, that's that's also got a door. That's got a door at east. Southeast has a door. That's the way I came from. Southwest? Can I go west? Okay, so I'm going west. Okay, I'm, I'm drawing my little map. This is going to be such a mess by the time I'm done with it. Alright, going west. Ding! Okay. Let's turn until we can find a direction to go in. Okay, we can go north here. So we're going north. Drawing my little map. <laughs> it's like an air hiss. Weird noise. I don't know how to describe that one. Um, I can keep going north here. I might as well. If it's a dead end, I guess I can just come back. Clang. That one is clang. Okay. Can't go that way. Can't go that way. South is the way I came from. So I'm not going back. Can't go that way. Can't go th oh, this may be a dead end, actually. Oh yeah, this is a dead end. Okay, let's, let's go back. <laughs> All right. Marking on my map, that is a dead end. I'm not coming back this way. Back. Down we go. Okay. Let's find another way. Yep, north was a dead end, so I'm not going that way. Please let me go east. Yes, I can go east. Okay, we're going east. What is here? Uh, 
That's also an air hiss. Okay. Well, um, no, I'm act I'm actually gonna go weast now. <laughs> All right, which way from here? <laughs> weast. Yeah, weast is my favorite. I remember times uh, back when I used to do raiding in Final Fantasy XIV, the amount of times I would say weast by accident. Just be like, everyone go weast, and then everyone would just be like, that's not a direction. Silly Sarana, what are you doing? <laughs> this is also a dead end. Oh no, no, I can go east. I can go east here, that's a different direction. I came from the west, because I went east. I can keep going. Okay. Is this whole thing just gonna be like trial and error making my way through? <laughs> like a clunk of some sort. Oh, I can go south? Yeah, let's go south. Why not? Clang. I don't know where I'm going, but I'm going there. I'm going to keep going south because I can. If it's another dead end, then so be it. I'm going really far with this one. This led back to the insect? Wait. Oh, okay. Okay. I think I just went around in a circle. Possibly. Maybe. This might be a different insect. If I, if I go west now and there's a ding, then I've gone around in a circle. I'm gonna try it. Oh, this has got like a wiggle to it. No, this is slightly different. This is a different path. Different path. This is different. This is a different insect. Oh, this feels like the right way. That was a clang and an insect. Okay. trying to tell me which direction to go in like when i heard the insect i went west when i heard the clang i went south do they, do they like match up to directions maybe maybe they might match up to directions because then the air hiss i went east no i've gone in different directions for each of them then ding north. I'm just gonna like try this and see if it works. So that was like a clang and an insect. So maybe I go southwest. There's a path at southwest. I think I might be onto something here. I think I might be onto something. I think I'm onto something. I think I can figure out which direction I need to go in by the sounds. I think clang means south, insect means west, ding means north, and hiss means east. But it could be the other way around for hiss and ding. I'm less confident on those. I'm confident on this, though. So funny if I end up at a dead end now. <laughs> that was just insect, so I think I go west. Yeah, west is available. I think I've got it. I've got it. I've got this. I figured it out. Oh my goodness. Yes. <laughs> I figured it out. This is right. Because when I went up with the air hiss, it was a dead end until I then went to the east. So yeah, I think I've got it. That was a ding and an insect. So that is northwest. That's southwest. Oopsie. So this is northwest. I got it. Oh, I'm so proud of myself. Also, Kira Boros, hello, welcome. Oh, congratulations. Oh, I hope you're enjoying it. Congratulations on the new computer. 
Alternatively, an insect has actually crawled up my leg. I would cry. Okay, that was a ding and a hiss. That is northeast. Oh, I'm so proud of myself for figuring this out. <laughs> That makes things so much easier now. There's actually a pattern to it. Pattern recognition, my, da my darling, my beloved. I love patterns. <laughs> just a ding, so that's just north. Yeah. Oh, yes. Oh, you are. It's so smooth. Didn't realize when you click play on a game, it just starts. Oh, I had a similar thing when I got my first PC for the first time. I used to play games on a laptop, so when I first got my PC, I was amazed. Okay, that was a clang and a hiss. Clang and hiss is southeast. That's northeast. I know my directions, I promise. Yeah. Oh, I love this. But yeah, I the first time I played a game on my new PC after playing on my laptop for so long, I was amazed by the texture in games. It was so funny because I actually went into like a Destiny 2 raid with some friends and they were all waiting for like the moment where I look over the horizon and everything is really cool. And I was just staring at the floor looking at like the blades of grass and the flowers because I couldn't believe there were flowers in the grass. I never saw them before. I was on potato graphics. It was so nice. Oh, oh, I'm so proud of that. I That was fun. I like that puzzle. I'm, I'm proud of myself for figuring that out. <laughs> that was a lot of fun. Like once I realized that each one like corresponded to a direction, it made it so much easier. Right, so now I guess... I guess I'm going down here. Potatoes are lovely. Potato graphics, not so much. Ooh. That's a lot of lava. Oh, you somehow got through there without using the noises. Oh! <laughs> See, as soon as I heard there were noises, Considering all of the sound stuff before, I was like, well, this is going to be relevant. Oh, I'm chibi now. Hi! Thank you for the chibi redeem. No, why did you do that? My head is full of explosives now. I just entered the lava area. Why? Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. This is the worst time to be chibi. <laughs> uh, if anyone's wondering what I'm talking about, uh, we decided whilst playing Divinity Original Sin that um, there's there are tiny skeletons in that game which are like explosive enemies and we decided that every chibi has that skeleton inside them including the explosives <laughs> so now now my head is full of explosives but it's okay so long as it does not ignite congratulations people have been complaining about that puzzle for decades and claiming it's too hard oh i i can see it being too hard if you don't pick up on the sound thing if you don't realize that each sound corresponds to a direction that would be so difficult. Well, I feel like less difficult, it would just be like really time consuming to just like trial and error and have to like backtrack when you get it wrong. But uh, I'm, I'm glad I, I found the sounds. I, it was fun. <laughs> it's very nice knowing exactly which direction I had to go in. But I did it. Wait, did I find I did find the pages here. Yes. Did I? I did. Yeah, because there was one by the sounds. Yes, I did find them. So yeah, I, I did it. Ha ha! So with that, I've been to all of the ages. And I've gotten the pages from them. And I've gotten the white page, which I feel will be important. And so now... I'm gonna save. I'm gonna save my game. I'm gonna make a new save file. I can only have two save files. The first one is being overridden. There, I'm, I'm making a save file for this one. <laughs> right, so now I'm like, the only thing I can think to do is give them the pages. Right, let's start with Cyrus because he seems a little bit more cognitively there than Akinar is. 
So let's let's see what he has to say now. Hi. Have returned. from your prison. I see that you are. You see that I'm one. I need all the red pages. I know. Must search and bring. Okay. Yeah, it's getting clearer the more of the pages I put in. So do I just give him all of them? I'm, I'm a little scared about what's gonna happen if I do. Let's do one more. Talk again. See if it's the same thing. Hi. With each page I can see more clearly. Yeah. Soon be free from this horror prison. Yes. Book. You must visit the one remaining eight. You have not. Don't worry, I did. Thank you for the headpad too. Yeah. He took advantage of the freedom our father had given us. Yeah. So did you, I think. I cannot get into it. Okay, I have a I have a thought about what's going on. I think Cirrus is gonna be like Akinar has lost it. He's awful, he's done terrible things, he can't be trusted, don't let him out. Akinar's gonna be like Cirrus has done terrible things. He's awful. He's terrible. He can't be trusted. Don't let him out. What if I let him out? What if I put in all the pages for both of them? If I can. Let's right, see what happens if I do this. All right. Hi. You finally returned. Yes. I owe you a debt of gratitude. For you yeah. have nearly released me. My name is Sirius. Yes. I trust, I trust that, that from your explorations you have become convinced that my wicked brother, Akinar, is guilty <laughs> and I am innocent. It is I who am wrongly imprisoned here. Imprisoned by my father. Mm. I don't know who you are or how you came to this island, but I assume you must have at least know something of the books. A little bit. It was father who was a master of the books. He wrote hundreds of them, all describing and linking to the fantastic places and ages which he had discovered. The room in which you now stand was our father's library. It was here in this room on this island named Mist that he housed most of these books. But such a waste. Such a waste? By now, you have surely discovered that Akinar has burnt and mutilated most of these books. Why? Our father was always watchful of our exploration. We grew up under his strict supervision. But when we came of age, he gave us unbridled access to the mystic books. He began to leave our adventures more and more unchecked. Mm. Unsupervised as we were, my brother began to become disturbed. Stard he began to take more from the missed ages than he had given. Soon he gained a twisted pleasure mm. from the conquest and destruction of the other yeah. ages. It was horrific. His thirst for destruction. But alas, even I discovered his insanity. He had completely destroyed all of the missed ages but four. I wasted no time. In warning my father, I thought he would recognize Akhenat's guilt. But in a fit of rage, he imprisoned both my brother and myself hmm. within the pages of these books. Yeah, but you're innocent, to right? Until he could judge which of us was guilty. To discover the truth. Our father embarked on one final journey. However, he has never returned. Uh, I can only assume that he perished along the way. 
So now it's down to me. An innocent victim trapped forever. Oh, yeah, you're so innocent. Yeah, now, I can tell. You are here to release me. <laughs> Listen carefully. You must find one more page, and I will be forever free. Okay. There is a book on the shelves in this library, which is mostly burned, but has a few pages still intact. It is the last book on the middle shelf. Find it. This book is filled with a variety of patterns. Ah. Find pattern 158 and recreate 158. the door of the fireplace. This will bring you to the last red page. Bring that page to me, and I will finally be released and able to reward you, of course. Yeah, reward me. I'm, I'm sure you will. the blue page. Mm -hmm. That page finishes my brother's book. Chills me to even think what would happen if you were to release him. There is another warning. Oh? Where the red and blue pages reside, also resides a green book. A green if book? If you touch the green book, you also will be imprisoned forever. Okay, cool. Our father gave us this same warning long ago. I suggest you follow his advice. Okay, Greenbrook Prison. Got it. <laughs> All right, thanks. Um, I don't trust you. I don't trust you at all, but that's good knowledge to have. Okay. 158 red page. <laughs> he seems quite nice. Yeah, he seems lovely until you see all of the stuff about him, like, gaining wealth and taxing people and just being a greedy, horrible man. <laughs> As opposed to his brother, who is awful and evil and did all of the bad things. I'm sure talking to Akunar as well now, he's going to be like, I did what's best for the people. Everyone loved me. Everything was great. And then Cyrus tried to take it all away. He tried to take all our money. He tried to take all our homes. I, th Yeah, th I think they're both bad. I think they're both guilty. They both did it. I, d <laughs> I don't trust either of them. Anyway, now that I've done that, I'm going to save the game again. And I'm going to do the exact same. Oh, I'm back to normal. I am large again. No longer chibi. No no worries about explosions now. <laughs> and now I'm going to do the same with Akana. I'm going to do it like a bit at a time again. Because I think it's like, it's mostly the same thing. I think. Ah, good. Yeah, he sounds fine. More blue pages you find. <laughs> Bring more. I must have some more. Yes, you must. All I ask of you. Long. It's so long since my brother Cyrus wrongfully imprisoned me within this book. Ooh. Stupid schemes. Wait, hold on. Okay, that's interesting. Cyrus says his father trapped them both. Akinar is now saying that Cyrus trapped him in there. Hmm. Hmm. Interesting. I love um, reliable narrators. <laughs> oh, my friend. Hi. Bring in the blue pages. <laughs> I see. Convinced the Cirrus is guilty. Pray, do not release him. Yeah. He will destroy me just to see. Innocent bystander. I've been wrongfully tricked into imprisonment. You've been tricked? Yeah, it's not your fault. You haven't done anything bad. Didn't you have observed his unbridled lust for riches? Yeah, he sounds fine. In the four remaining worlds. <laughs> you some plot. It was almost perfect. Final blow to the father. <laughs> you tricked him into believing that it was I. <laughs> Who was the matter? I didn't murder father. Murder? <laughs> Bring me the remaining. Yes, please. Okay. Yeah, he sounds fine. But yeah, I love so much that the Miller brothers actually play them. And like, when I went into it, like, there was an option in the settings to have, like, new videos 
or to have the original FMV videos. And I instantly was just like, I want the FMV videos for this. The only thing I wish is that I wish they had subtitles. Even if it was just for like a few words, I would love a few subtitles because goodness gracious, what is that? But uh, it's it's something I'm I'm willing to deal with. Right, so let's see where the last blue page is. Hi. Hello. I'm Akana. Hi. I know. I'm glad to see that you've returned to help me escape from my wrongful imprisonment. He was serious to do this to me. Serious. My Ooh. wicked brother. Do not listen to him. I warn you. I warn you. He's a liar. Yep. Do not be persuaded by his evil lies. I release him. He killed my father. He will kill you. <laughs> began when my brother Sirius began to lust for riches. Mm -hmm. He stole from the ages of mist. He hoarded riches for himself. My father. My father slipped away. His watchfulness. <laughs> my sick brother secretly pronounced himself king. <laughs> king of the ages of mist, he said. Mm -hmm. Whoa. He began to look upon me in disgust. His lowly brother! He did him! <laughs> and then Cirrus began to destroy the Ages of Mist. He burned their forest. <laughs> he tore down their structures. He flooded their lands. Whoa. He murdered their inhabitants. Completely destroyed. All but four of the Ages. Of course, I had a woman father. I finally found him. There was Cirrus also talking cleverly. <laughs> the lying tongue of a serpent. He had convinced father that it was I who destroyed the ages. He convinced mm. father that it was I who was greedy for wealth and plunder. And as Cirrus dealt the final blow, he tricked the father into believing that I was the murderer. But Cirrus did not deal as fast a blow as he planned. And his father died a slow death. He at last doubted my brother's clever lies, and so in dying, father imprisoned us both. I'm sure from which of us the blow had come. <laughs> I swear to you, what I say is true. Release me. <laughs> you must release me. My brother's a deceitful liar and deserves punishment. I only wish vengeance for my dear father. Murder. Yeah, I'm Believe sure. Me. You must only recover one additional page to okay. release from this prison. It's the easiest to find. Go to the bookshelf. It's in this library. Mm -hmm. On the far right side of middle the middle shelf, shelf there's yep. a burned book, which is different from the other yeah. burned books. This book is filled with patterns. Fine pattern 158. Okay, so they're both Mimic at 158. Mimic design on the panel in the fireplace. Doing this will bring you the last blue page. Okay. Remember, don't take the red page. Only the blue page. Okay. Return quickly to me. And do not touch the green book. It's a okay. clever trap to imprison those who have not been warned. <laughs> do not be tempted, for you will rot and die. Prison design. <laughs> That's nice. I tell you, if you follow my instructions, it will be well worth your while. I promise you that. Yeah, you'll you'll reward Go. me, I'm sure. Go. Yep. All right, I'll go. Yeah. So listening to these two, they are both filthy liars who can't be trusted, and I want to touch the red book. <laughs> no, the red book, the green book. I want to touch the green book. I'm the the more they're like do not go near the green book it's a trap the more it makes me want to touch it not gonna lie I like the more they tell me not to the more I'm like I'm, I'm gonna touch it I'm gonna touch it I'm gonna save the game before I do but I'm I'm gonna touch it <laughs> all right 158 oh it opened it to me to the page for me that was nice that's very nice of it Okay, 158. Let me take a photo of this so that I don't have to keep going back and forth. Okay, 158. I've got it. <laughs> no, Larry, don't touch the stovetop. I'm gonna touch it. <laughs> you can't tell me what to do. Okay. 
right, here we go. 158. We go... Boom, boom. Not that one. Boom, 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 boom. We do that one. We do that one. Bum, bum. Bum. Da, 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 da. These two. That one. And then this corner. Like that? See, I don't know what to do now. Like, I put all this in. What do I do? Do I press button? Oh, I do! Yes! Okay, the button actually did something this time. Solve the fireplace puzzle. Oh, good. <laughs> oh, I... Okay, okay, here we go. See, part of me thinks that taking either of these pages is gonna give me, like, a bad end. So I kind of want to do that. <laughs> Like, I feel like if I free either of these guys, they're going to either kill me or imprison me in the same book. Like, I, it's not going to end well. I feel like the green book is the right thing to do. So I kind of want to just... I'm, I'm, I'm going to grab a page. What happens if I just take both of them? They insisted I must only take one. What if I just take both of them? Right, how do I get out now? Just do like any random thing? Yeah. Close that up. Okay. I got both of them. So, um... Let's go for Akinar first, because he seems... Like, Cirrus feels more actively evil. Akinar seems more, um he's slowly lost his moral compass kind of evil like a little more unhinged but i guess more like chaotic evil versus lawful evil if you know what i mean <laughs> so i'm gonna go akana first let's see how this goes give him the book give him the page i think this will be fine wait what happens if i just put them on the shelf but i won't actually give him the page Yeah, the D&D &D approach. Yeah. <laughs> I'm I'm going to do it. I'm going to Okay, Akna. I'm freeing you. Don't make me regret it. I'm going to regret it, I think. I'm free. Achieved bad ending with Akna. Yeah, what do you know? Oh, hi. Hello. Oh, yes. oh this is the CG now. <laughs> okay. <laughs> How do you feel, my friend? <laughs> I can't believe you what tricked me. Here? I didn't see that coming. Perhaps the pages you worked so hard for. <laughs> oh. Oops. <laughs> Goodness me, I can't believe you betrayed me. That Perhaps is such a surprise. You seen the world yes. from my point of view. <laughs> what a surprise. Yeah, I wonder why it, it changed to this, because I, I haven't touched the settings. Serious? <laughs> Serious? Thanks, he's just ripping all the pages out again. Yeah, that is. I wish it was the FMV. Someone this is so awesome. <laughs> No, what a shame! Yes! Yes! <laughs> Can't believe you would betray me like that. So sad. You lose! <laughs> Goodness me, I never expected that. I couldn't have seen that coming. What a what a shock. I can't believe I would get trapped instead, and then he would maniacally rip the pages out. Such a surprise. Anyway, I guess I'm trapped in the void for eternity? I guess I'm, I'm just stuck in the ether now? That's nice! I did it! Woo! 
Oh, given how close up the 2021 designers wanted the window to be. Oh, yeah, I guess it would be like really low resolution considering the time and stuff. That would, that makes sense then. That makes sense as to why they wouldn't just have like a tiny little video there. <laughs> it's a little different when it's inside the book. But yeah, I guess it would be very tiny. Anyway, I did it. I won. I solved all of the mysteries and didn't get trapped for eternity. <laughs> right, that's exactly what I thought would happen, so... I'm gonna skip the credits. I'll leave the credits for when I actually, like, finish the game decently. Oh, it autosaved too. That's nice. Where's the autosave? Be so funny if it auto-saved as the ending happened. Oh, it's before I put the page in. That's great. Oh, that's very handy, because now I can just go and do this. Which I'm sure will not go similarly at all. I Cirrus seems like a trustworthy type. He's going to let us out, right? You fool. Achieved bad ending with Cirrus. Nice. Yes. Hi. Yes. I'm free! What have you done to me? Oh, thank you, my friend. You're welcome. Now get me out. My dear friend. Yeah? You've done the right thing. Yeah? You stupid fool. Oh, thanks. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like perhaps you're in the book now. Yeah. It does seem that way, huh? And what have we here? A page. <laughs> yep. That's what I expected. Oh no. <laughs> oh no, what a shame. Oh, oopsie, accidentally tore another one out, huh? I hope you enjoy your new home as much as I enjoyed it. Thanks, I'm sure it's awful. Yeah, the achievement timing does suck. It, I wish it would pop up like you. after you're this whole scene. <laughs> I hope you're into books. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm literally into books right now. I'm, I'm in it, I'm, I'm in this book in it. <laughs> Thanks. Thank you. It's much the same so lovely. What a, what a lovely Why little home on here. <laughs> oh, great. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Goodbye. <laughs> okay, bye. My home. Nice! Somehow I just knew those would be bad endings. I was like, letting either of these guys free is a bad idea. And that's why I wanted to do it. <laughs> but yeah, I love my little void prison. That was very cool. Nice! Right, now let's, um... I'm gonna touch the green book. I'm gonna touch the green book. Oh, I should do my other save file. Cause this one's like outside of the door and I'll have to put the code in again. <laughs> uh, 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 give me control. Yeah, I'm gonna just load. There. Fabulous. Right, I'm, I'm touching the green book. <laughs> Oh, I wonder if this is different depending on if you have the page or not. Oh, maybe I shouldn't have taken the white page. Oh, I wonder if I can, like, add the white page to the book. Oh, hey! Who the devil are you? Hi. Come, you haven't done it. Not yet. Oh, I have many questions for you, my friend. As oh? You no doubt have for me. Where should I begin? Perhaps my story is an old. My name is Atrus. I feel you've met my son, Cirrus and Hagenor, and read the yeah. new books on Mist Island in my library. Uh, my library contains my works, my writings. Oh, I wrote many books that link me to fantastic places. It's an art I learned from my father many years ago. Huh. Oh, but the red and blue books, those were different. I wrote those books to entrap greedy explorers who might stumble upon my island of 
missed. But I had no idea my own sons was being trapped. My sons. Cirrus and Akinar. They are the great explorers. I gave them free reign to the books. And they took advantage. Perhaps it was not wise. I could see the greed growing in them. I had not told them about the red and blue books. Their imaginations went wild. They dreamed of riches and power. Of course, they did not know the books were traps. They begged me for access to those books, and I, of course, denied them. a plan, an evil plan. I had no idea to what extent their greed had progressed. Their own mother, oh, my own dear Catherine. They used her to lure me here to Dunny. What? Uh, of course, I could return to Mist, except they removed a single page from my Mist linking book. <gasps> I cannot return without that page. I have that page. You, my friend, can bring that page to me. Oh, I pray you believe my story above the lies that my sons have told you. If you could find it in yourself to return that page to me here in Dunny. Dunny? Go to Mist. Bring justice to my sons for what they've done. I must return to my writing. I pray that you believe me. Please hurry. Bring the page. Bring the page with you. I have it. I have the page. I have the page. Can I can I visit you? Yeah? Yeah, I'm going to bring in the page. We can get back. Do I recognize the actor? I am I'm terrible at recognizing faces, especially when it's that small. I'm I'm really bad at recognition for things, but you're welcome to say if you want. <laughs> oh, I I love how they were both like, oh, my father trapped me here. Oh, Sarah's trapped me here. They trapped themselves. The silly fools. They trapped themselves because they were too greedy. That is so funny. <laughs> oh, there he is. I see him. I kind of want to explore. Can I explore? I probably can't explore. The doors are all shut. So is this done even? Oh, music. Oh, my friend, you've returned. Yes. Hi. And the page. Did you bring the page? Uh, what if I didn't? <laughs> uh, I got the page. You've done the right thing. Have I? I have a difficult choice to make. I mean, that's what the boys said, too, and I, I don't think I made the right choice then. But this feels a bit better. My sons have betrayed me. I know what I must do. I shall return shortly. Okay. And now because the book's here, I can also return. I Oh, I bet it's so funny if I come here without having the page. Oh, I have to I, I have to start a new game afterwards just to try and like get here without the page and just get trapped with him. I feel like he'll just be like, why did you do that? Why would you? <laughs> why would you do that? Alright, I, I go? Me go? Oh, everything in its place. Achieve the good ending. Yes. Mm. Hi. It is done. Okay. I have many questions for you, my friend, but my writing cannot wait. Okay. I fear that my long delay may have already had a catastrophic impact on the world in which my wife, Catherine, is now being oh, held hostage. Held hostage? Oh. <laughs> is it called rhythm? <laughs> I'm sorry, but all I have to offer you is the library on the island of mist. That is fine. Books that are contained there. That's a great reward. Thank free you. Free to explore at your leisure. <laughs> You find your exploration satisfying. You'll I will. No it's have lovely. My sons to deal with. <gasps> oh. Oh, and one more thing. Oh. I'm fighting a foe much greater than my sons could ever imagine. At some point in the future, 
I may find it necessary to request your assistance. Okay, yeah. Until that point, I'm afraid you'll enjoy the explorations from my library on Mist. Yeah, that's fine. Thank you. You are welcome. Nice to meet you, buddy. Uh, let's head back. The book. Oh. You can use the Mist linking book to return to Mist. I figured, thank you. I, I guess that, thank you. I did it! Ha ha! Success! I got the good ending! Denis, uh, return to Mist Island from Denis. Nice! I did it! Oh, yeah, he just... Yeah, he just got rid of... He, j he just burnt those. He fully just burnt them. Wow. Goodbye. Okay. Wow, that is intense. But uh, I did it! I beat Mist. Oh, that was great. That was so cool. Yeah, I can't believe he straight up just... Burned the books entirely, but like... That must have been the hardest decision for him as a father to make. Because, like... Even though they were, like, twisted and evil beyond belief, they were still his sons. They're, they're still his sons. Even through everything, that must have been so difficult. Like, I could have done it for him. I could do it. Oh, oh, that's also Rand! Oh, I guess that makes sense, like, the family resemblance as well. I didn't recognize him when he wasn't, um, losing his mind. <laughs> that's great. Uh, he claims to be rather embarrassed about the fact that he acts in his own game, but he's actually quite versatile. He's a great actor. Honestly, they they did amazing jobs in it. That was great. Yeah. Yeah, Atrus wouldn't have asked me to do something he wasn't willing to. Yeah, he he wouldn't want to, like, fob that off onto somebody else. He, he'd be like, I kind of caused this with the freedom I gave them. I know what I have to do. I have to deal with this as difficult as it is. But uh, I did it! I, I beat Mist. Right, I'm going to... I'm going to make a save. Like here. I completed it! Look, I got a star now. And what I'm going to do is I want to try something. I want to see if I start a new game, if it'll let me just do the fireplace code and immediately touch the green book. <laughs> like, I don't know if it'll let me, but I want to try it. I'm gonna try it. Uh, classic. I want the same code, thank you very much. But oh, th this having the randomized mode as well means that it can be replayed as well without just instantly knowing all the codes. Oh, I have to have this again. This the cryptic. Oh, it's the book. The the linking book to Mist. I realized the moment I fell into the fissure that the book would not be destroyed as I. Oh. He was trying to continue falling into that starry expanse of which I had only a fleeting glimpse. Oh. I've tried to speculate where it might have landed, but I must admit that such conjecture is futile. Still, the questions about whose hands might one day hold my misbook oh. are unsettling to me. I know my apprehensions might never be allayed, and so I close, realizing that perhaps the ending has not yet been written. So interesting seeing this, like knowing the story now as well. How interesting. All right, let me in. Oh, uh, oh, making a missed video. Oh, I'll have to check that out. Also, hello, welcome, welcome. Oh, I still have the original disc from Windows 95. Oh, that's so cool. I love that. I have the DS cartridge for this game, which um is not good. It's really bad. It might be the reason why I've blocked the game out of my memory because I played it on DS and it just wasn't good. <laughs> but, uh... Oh, thank, thank you for telling me how to open the menu. Right, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna see if it'll let me just immediately put it in and then jump in the book. <laughs> thank you for the tutorials. I don't need them the button make sure I've got my code I've got it if 
that, that, that. You go there, you go there. Boom. Boom. There. Yes, it does work. Okay. I'm, I, I just touched it. Oopsie. <laughs> I wonder... I, I feel like he's just gonna... Like, just be like, why? Why would you do that? Now you're stuck here too. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Ah, my friend, you've returned. We meet face to face. Yes. And the page, did you bring the page? Oh, I knew I was forgetting something. You didn't bring the page. No. You didn't bring the page. My bad. <laughs> what kind of fool are you? <laughs> I knew I'd be you called a fool. You take my warning seriously. I knew it. I knew I'd be called a fool. It's my favorite well, insult. Danny, <laughs> Thank you. you. And I will live here. Okay. Forever. Nice. Okay. Roommates achieve the bad ending with ages. <laughs> oh, see the achievement popped up at the right time there. That's great. I did it. I won. Oh, that's great. Right, I'm gonna go back to like my new game plus thing. Oh, I skipped the credits too. I need to actually watch the credits because I wanna I wanna watch the credits. I feel like whenever I play a game that I really enjoy, I do wanna watch through the credits because I feel like people deserve the credit for a job well done. I wonder if I can just Yeah, I can do it through the menu. Here we go, now we credits. <laughs> Because I expected it when we got the good ending. But of course, we just ended up back on the island again. So I didn't. But now we get the credits. And it's silent. That is so weird. It's completely silent. I expected music. I, I was hoping for music. Alright, well, while the credits happen, hold on. I'm going to put some like really quiet like elevator music on just because it's too quiet. <laughs> it's just too quiet. Right, what are the achievements now that I've done it? Whoa, I'm missing quite a few achievements. Ooh, okay. I thought I'd done pretty well, but um, I'm apparently missing eight achievements. I'm missing- Eight. Achievements. <laughs> So I wonder what they are. I guess it's probably like bonus stuff, like missable stuff. Interesting. Ah. Uh, yeah, honestly, uh, Mist was one of the last, if not the last point and click adventure game because real time first person games were taking off. Well, that depends on like what you mean by that. Like there are still amazing point and click adventure games being released nowadays as well but definitely from like a, a major game release kind of point of view yeah i can i can see where you're coming from yeah i can't believe i missed eight achievements how could i but yeah it's i i love point and click games i've got such a soft spot for them i have so many fond memories of when i was younger playing so many point and click games like I one of my fondest memories is the Broken Sword series. Uh Broken Sword, Broken Sword 2, and Broken Sword 3. Those three specifically. I love those games. I love them so much. I'd love to replay them again. Because honestly, like when I played them, I was probably a little young to fully appreciate them. <laughs> like I feel like playing them as an adult will be like I'll pick up on more of like references and stuff. But uh, I love the Broken Sword games. They are so good. And I know there's loads that have been released after the ones I've played as well that I've not gotten around to. So I would love to... I would love to, like, replay those at some point. Because I think I won't remember much of those either. Like, I, there are, like, three specific scenes I remember in my head. And then the rest of it is, like, very blurry. I don't remember much. <laughs> Like, the one thing I remember very vividly is, like, there was one scene with a goat. And, like, if you mess up with the goat, you have to, like... 
y you get like hard locked out of the game, at least like when I played it. <laughs> it was like a full hard lock situation and I had to restart the game because I messed up with this goat. <laughs> I think it's something that's been fixed in like re-releases, like not from the original CD-ROM. But yeah, I, I remember that at the time because I was so upset about messing up this goat thing. <laughs> Oh, and yes, you can point me towards anywhere I may have missed stuff now. Now is the moment for pointing out all of the little stuff I might have missed along the way. Hee <laughs> hee, missed. Missed, missed. I love the missed puns. Ah, the room by the dock. Oh, I haven't been in there for a while. Oh, I wonder, does that change like every time I visit an, an age? Because there were all the little alcoves around the edge. I bet those change when I when I visit the ages and stuff. Oh, I never went back there, yeah. I must check. I must check. Ah. Uh, there's a website to play old adventure puzzle games. Oh! Oh, I, I might have to check that out. I may have to check that out. Also, Curse of Monkey Island. Oh! I never actually played the Monkey Island games. I feel like they're the kind of games I would love, but I never actually got around to playing them. Maybe I gotta fix that. Maybe I should fix that. Hmm. Hmm. Much to think about. Anyway, eleva elevator music off. Let's resume the game. We have game sound again. <laughs> oh, wanna know a fun fact about the last red blue pages in the original game? Yes, definitely. But uh, oh, the next release part of canon is the Book of Atris, which was published in 1995. Oh, that's cool. I'll have to look look into that. Because uh, my plan was to to go into Riven next, but if there's something in between, I want to check that out. I definitely want to check that out. Right, let's go back in here. Yeah, she didn't erase that message. Either she didn't erase the message, or she just didn't um, listen to it in the first place. Hmm. Doesn't seem to be anything new here, though. Unless there's something else I can do here. A different number I can put in. Hmm. But oh, they were coded to trigger their respective endings, so you could just put those in the book without getting the other four. That's interesting! I wonder if it's the same in this. Oh, that would be so funny if it's the same in this one. Hmm. Is there anything else I'm missing around here? I didn't see anything new down here. At least I don't think I did. It's just the same message. Hmm. Right, but there's... Not new, just not done. What have I not done down here? Is there a way I can erase the message? <laughs> What am I missing? What am I missing? So I'm trying to think. Have I gotten any other numbers? Oh, what if I do seven? Nice beep. 
Oh, maybe the numbers are for here. Oh, top, top topographical extrusion test number 40. Let's try that. Ah, I think that's what I missed. Nice little beeps. Hello? Yes! Oh, that's what, yeah, that's what these numbers are for. I think, like, I presumed it was to do with the diagram book when I saw all of the pages in there. Oh, that's cool. That's cool. Okay, marker switch diagram, 47. I don't really need that, but let's have a look at it anyway. Nice little beeps. No, no, it's just showing me what the marker switches are. I, that felt easy enough to figure out. <laughs> It felt easy enough to figure out that the marker switch was the switch. The various switches around the island. And water turbulent pool. That sounds cool. Let's see, is that what it was on by default? Yeah, it was. The cool ripples. Nice. Okay. Okay, yeah, I'm glad I saw that. Thank you. I'm also glad I figured it out myself, even though I asked. <laughs> I love just like, uh, here's a diagram of what a mark switch is. It, it can't be like these massive switches everywhere, right? Surely not. Right, I wonder what the achievements are. Because the fact that I've missed eight achievements, that feels like quite a lot. Like, let me have a quick look. Let's see, because I've got 18 out of 26 achievements. Eight. Oh, they're all hidden achievements. Okay. Uh, <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Do I do I look all these up? I might look up the achievements. Just so I can do them. Let's have a look. All right, achievements. Uh, oh! Okay, there's an achievement called Top of the World, which is ride the tree to its highest point. I can't believe I didn't do that. Oh, actually, that's a really good idea. I've only looked at one so far because I just, like, clicked to unreveal one. Uh, if people want to post the, the titles, that's a, that's a really good way of me, like, having a little hint but not knowing exactly what what it is. Right, so I'm just gonna, like, crack this all the way and run. I want to go up to the top. <laughs> Bring it all the way up. I can't believe I never rode it to the top because I, I did it, like, on the way back down. I actually figured it out properly, which... I figured out the way it kept going up and down. There it is! I got it! I'm on top of the world! Am I stuck now? Oh no, there's a button. Okay. Nice! Oh. Gonna keep going down? Gonna go up, up and down? Oopsie! Haha! <laughs> I shouldn't have pressed it more than once. I think I just have to be patient. No, it's just going like down and then up again. Okay. I just keep pressing it. Okay, okay, I'm, I'm fine. I thought I was stuck then. <laughs> I thought I was stuck. Oh, it looks like this is the best week of the month for you to have to go 30 minutes early. Yes, because I actually finished it. It works out nicely. I'm so glad. <laughs> yeah, um, let me, I'm going to quickly go on my, like, Steam achievements list. Um, the other achievements I don't have, they are all, like, from the bottom. Like, from the bottom upwards. So it's all, like, the least gotten achievements. So if you just want to, like, throw a title at me, I can try and figure it out. be interesting to see if I I might have to like start a new game if if it's if there are some that are like don't pick up any pages or whatever perfect pitch ah. oh 
I wonder... I wonder if there's going to be an achievement for getting that perfect first time, and I didn't get it because I pressed the button randomly and just inputted, like, the default notes. I think I would have to start a new... I'm going to start a new game. I'm, I've got my save. I'm going to load... Okay, yeah, I, I need to do a new game again. We'll have to sit through... <laughs> have to sit through the start again. It's okay. But yeah, the way a Steam works is most of the time... It'll show you the achievements list when you click to look at achievements, but sometimes games will have hidden achievements. So if there are spoilers for the games, like the devs will set it as a hidden achievement, so you don't get it, you don't fissure, view the description. Be destroyed as I had planned. Continue on, falling gonna, into that starry expanse. Of Mute the game for a second so I can just chat. <laughs> While the, the intro scene thing happens. But yeah, it's just like, um, sometimes, most of the time the achievements are just like game progression, very normal things that don't have spoilers attached. But sometimes there'll be like little bonus things or secret moments that people might not want to be spoiled by. And it's really nice because it gives you an option to click to reveal the achievement if you want to see, but it won't show you unless you actively click that. It will just stay hidden until you get it. And then once you've gotten that achievement, it shows up and you can read the description and stuff. I think it's a really good way of doing it. It's a nice achievement system because I sometimes I'll like look at achievements and I'll be like, well, that feels like I it's spoiled how to get it. <laughs> and I, I do like figuring it out myself to at least a slight degree. Okay, well, the elevator music didn't last very long, but... Uh, there we go. Right, I, th I think it's gonna be stuff like this. Uh, the other ones are It's Bob, uh, Know It All, uh, Never Lost, After All of That Effort, Stack Overflow Speedy. Hmm. Speedy. Oh, that feels like it might be a speedrun thing. I don't know if I want to do that. Maybe I can one day. Oh, actually, no. A, a speedrun might not be that hard to do, to be honest. All right, how did I do this again? It was... Where are my numbers? I've lost my numbers. Hold on. It was that one. 22 and 19. I made 41. 57, 59, there we go. Oh, it should have been gaps between them. Yeah, if, if you have it on like a new line and you paste it into Twitch, it just kind of smushes it all together. <laughs> I've got my musical notes. I feel like it's probably this because like I I just clicked on the button not knowing what it would do and submitted like the same note five times. Otherwise I would have already gotten this. If if it even is this, it might not even be this. It might be something in the other area. <laughs> So the first two are da 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 Those are the first two. And the next one is this one. Da da think it's that one. And then four is ba 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 ba. Da. Ha. 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 That's the one. And the last one is. Ha. 
ba 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 da 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 ba 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 I think that's it yeah it was that yes yes okay okay I should have gone that the first time but I, I saw a lever and I wanted to pull it <laughs> Right. What else is that? Know it all? Uh, never lost after all of that effort. Stack overflow speedy. Hmm. I uh, thought it was going to be getting the combo without using the organ at all. Just looking at the notes and knowing the pitch. That would be so over the top. That would be like... That would be like way over complicated, even for like a sound puzzle. Like you would have to like legitimately be a musician to know that. <laughs> that would be wild. I'm glad it wasn't that much. Right, never lost. What could that be? Uh, this perfect pitch. Well, it's still perfect pitch being able to match it up first time. Because being able to get the exact same note is... It's tricky if you don't... If you're not, like, more musically inclined. It's extremely difficult. Uh, oh, there's pictures with the achievements. Oh, that might be helpful. What are the pictures? If you don't mind me asking. Yeah, oh, just turn the volume off and align the sliders with the keys. Oh, do they match up with the keys? I did not even notice that. I was purely just listening the whole time. It does! Oh, it's got the keys at the side! Oh, I didn't even realize that. Oh, that's a really nice touch. I didn't even notice that. I didn't notice the markings. That's so good! I was instantly just like, music? Oh, God, this. Oh, Never Lost has the compass thing from the track puzzle. Ooh. I think I could do that. I think I could do that. I have my notes. I have my notes on which direction to go. I could, I can definitely do that. I can do that. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do that. I've got, I've got the notes. I know that hiss means you go east, uh, ding means you go north, uh, clang means you go south, and an insect means you go west. So I can do that. I'm gonna do it. Yeah! I'm not gonna get lost. Also, Parker Solum Seria, I forgot to say hi to you as well, but hello, welcome! Welcome in anyone if if I've missed saying hi to anyone as well. Hello. I'm I usually say hi instantly, but I feel like especially for a game like this, I'm I'm getting like so so engrossed in it. So intensely engrossed in it. It's so fun. I love puzzles that I I really just get fully absorbed in. Anyway, I wrote this down too. So uh, bah, 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 bah. Where is my note for this part? Oh, I, I write my notes on too many pieces of paper. I can never find the ones I'm looking for. There it is. So this one is crystal, water, falling in a hole, lava, clock. There's the crystals. There's the water. Falling in a hole. There's the lava. There's the clock. There's the clock. There we go. Yeah. 
Yeah, oh, I'm missing so many greetings. I'm so sorry, hello. I'm so glad to have people joining me for this though, because this game is so much fun. This has been such a great, great adventure. I'm having such a blast with it. I'm so glad I managed to get past my hurdle of um, not getting up the elevator. It, it's gone so smoothly ever since then. Like, I can't believe it took me three hours to figure out how an elevator works, but you know what? It's okay. Right, we're going. We're going, I can do this. Instructions. I got him. Okay. I know my directions. I'm not gonna get lost once. Watch this. Watch this. First try time. We start with an insect, that means we go west. Also, I haven't played Riven. Oh yeah, I should do a cheeky save here. That's that's really smart. I'll do a save. So if I d oh, I can't save here. <laughs> oh, never mind. Oopsie. Uh, he Where was the auto save? I think it auto saved before I just stepped in here. So you know what? I want to save before I step in there, just in case. I don't think I'll need it. But just in case. Yeah, the game doesn't want you to save scum. That's probably a good thing. But yeah, I definitely plan on playing Riven. I really want to. Oh, I have to put this in again, I think. Yeah, I didn't save after I put the stuff in. It's okay. It's okay, I can do this. We go crystals. We go water. We go... Is that already the falling down a hole? I think it might be. Yeah, it is. And then lava. And the clock. There we go. Okay, now I save. Save. Not over my completed game. Ha ha ha. But yeah, I'm, I definitely want to play Riven. I, th I think like the, the Riven remake coming out earlier in the year was what, it was like the trigger that was that made me go, you know what, I should play this now. I don't remember anything about it. I've not really like fully experienced it. I should play this now. And I'm so glad I did. I'm very glad I did. <laughs> right, but I, I know I know my directions now. I know what I'm doing. I know where I have to go. I figured this out. I'm not going to get lost. Ooh. Insect. Here we go west. Yep. Now it's going to be a ding. Ding, and we go north. Yes. Next, it should be a hiss, and we go east. From when I made my little map, I have the first few before I realized it was sound based and I didn't need the map. And we go east. So now it's going to be a Question mark? Maybe. That's a hiss. That's east. Wait, 
hold on. Oh yeah, we go east again. Okay. Keep listening. Clang, now we go south. Oh, there's three novels too. Oh, I have to check that out. I have to check that out. I want to find so much more out about this. Oh, there's actually another world that Real Mist added after the good ending, but they didn't have time to add it in this remaster. Oh, that's so cool. That's so cool if they're like planning on adding it at some point though. Even if it takes a while. That's really interesting. Maybe I have to play Real Mist now just to see that extra bit. Right, well, we go south for Clang. Clang, we keep going south. Haha. <laughs> Lawless passage. I'm so glad I noticed the sounds and realized. I didn't realize the sounds, to be honest, until I heard the two together. My insect is west, as east. <laughs> But like when I heard the two together, I was like, wait, is that gonna be like a a mid-cardinal direction? And it was. And that was like the moment I realized. <laughs> and on I go. I'm going, yes. And now it's gonna be the double ones. Insect Clang, Southwest. Boom. I'm confident. Just Insect, that's just West. Ding and an insect. Northwest. <laughs> Pretty boring roller coaster, to be honest. There's no loops or anything. Kiss and a ding. Northeast. Just north. Maybe I didn't get the achievement because I turned it the wrong way a couple times. Well, if that's the case, that's... That's fine. If that's the case, then um, I go the wrong way so often. I'll, I'll just leave that one. 
I tried. What are the other ones? <laughs> I'll do it off stream to like fuel my completionist aspect. Like I, I like completing games, but uh, that's, I feel like that counts. I feel like that counts. That's fine. But oh, thank you so much, Bree. Thank you for stopping in. I'll do a little more achievement hunting before I finish, but. Yes. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, the the de decision to invest in tunnel exploration here is somewhat something of a plot hole. You're under an ocean near volcano and in an area prone to meteors. <laughs> yeah, it's a very interesting choice. It's Bob is a picture of a skeleton head. Oh, I did. I saw the skeleton on the um that place, like with the the tele telescope. But it nothing happened when I looked at it. Hold on, I'm gonna like save anyway. No, I'm I'm just gonna leave that. I'm gonna load my completed one and go back to the mechanical place because I saw I saw a skeleton with the mechanical place. But nothing happened, so I'm I'm gonna try do that again. <laughs> like maybe, maybe I missed something. But I spotted it. I don't remember which direction I was when I spotted it. It might have been the hiss. No, I think it might have been the insect actually. It was either the insect or the hiss. I don't remember which one. <laughs> but uh, let me try again. Because it seemed like the kind of thing that should have triggered something to happen. Even though it didn't. So let's, let's have a look. Now that I know how to control everything, it is easy. But yeah, because like there was one of the directions I could see a little skeleton through the spyglass. I don't remember which direction it was, so we'll find out. In fact, uh, the, or the original plan for the maze uh, to was for the maze to be a walking maze, but they calculated how much disk space the total frames would have taken up. It was bigger than the rest of the game. <gasps> that's so funny. Oh, that's a smart way of getting around it, though, like with the the limitations of the time. Oh, that's that's so interesting to know, though. Right. Right, hiss. Let's try hiss. Let's see if it's hiss. If it's not, I think it might be insect. We shall see. I'm gonna be completely wrong now and it's completely different. Let's see. not this one or maybe it is this one it's actually out here because I don't know which direction the thing would have been looking in to see it through the spyglass I don't know I think it's the insect I'm gonna try the insect dun 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 yeah, to be sure, they could definitely make the maze they originally planned now that it isn't pre-rendered. But yeah, it, I, I really appreciate the fact that they wanted to make it like as, as true to the original as they could. Like, I, I really respect that. I like that. I like it a lot. But like, I'm pretty sure like I read stuff too where they, they wanted things to be like a 3D island you can walk around. But obviously, like, when it first came out, like, the limitations of tech back then, it, it would not be possible. At least not in, like, a good way. <laughs> bum, 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 bum. That's the ding. I don't think it's the ding. 
I'm gonna go check anyway. Because it could be now. I'll just try all of them. I'm just gonna try all of them. And hopefully one is right. Maybe it is the ding. Oh, it can provide me with the recommended sequence for going through the mist cannon. Oh, I would definitely be interested in seeing that. Like, always when there are, like, long-standing series of games, I love having, like, a recommended order to go through. Like, I remember when I was playing the Rusty Lake games, the developers actually gave a recommended order to play the games in for Rusty Lake, and it really made the experience so much better going through them, like, in that order. It made sense. Good games. Good games. I think it is the insect. I think... I keep, like, second-guessing myself, but I'm pretty sure it is the insect. Ba -ba -ba -ba. There's the insect. Okay. But yeah, my plan was to play Riven next, because... Like it's, like, it's listed on the thing saying Riven, the sequel to Mist, so it feels right to play it. Especially with the remake coming out as well, like, that's already come out. I say coming out, it's, it's been released. It's been out for months now. <laughs> yeah, I love the Rusty Lake games, but they are, they are so weird. They are so twisted. Like, it's hard to understand. Yeah, like, I saw the skeleton here. I can't seem to do anything. Like, I would guess it would be related to that, but for some reason, like... Nothing's happening. Where would it be outside? Which direction is that pointing in? It's pointing that way. I don't see anything out here. Maybe the, maybe the achievement's bugged. It's very possible that some of the achievements might... I might have to, like, do it in a certain org order. Yeah, I haven't gotten the achievement for Bob. I, I saw it on the way out of this level before as well. And nothing happened. So that might, that might be a bug. I might have to restart the game and, like, try and do it fresh. <laughs> but at least I know. At least I know. I, I I don't mind like not getting the achievements if I've like viewed it at least. <laughs> right, let's um reload back on the island. Cause uh, I'm I'm guessing like the speed run one is gonna be to just complete the game as quickly as possible. And I don't go fast. I'm not a fast gamer. Oh, oh no, it all looks like the the switch. I see. Hmm. I wonder if it'd be related to like not pulling the dock switch on purpose and pulling all of the other ones and instantly getting the page. Very possible. Oh, quite the list. Oh, interesting. Interesting. I'll have to check that stuff out, but uh, I do I do want to go into Riven from Mist. So what I'll probably do is I'll I'll like I'll, from this I'll go into Riven and then look at like the other Mist games as well and maybe like fill in the gap between if that makes sense. Like have it as more of like a prequel sequel situation. If it makes sense, but uh, I, I definitely want to delve deeper into this series because it's been so great. It's been so fun. I think like with the achievements, I might leave it at this for now because I, I feel like I've I've accomplished what I wanted from the game. <laughs> I've had so much fun playing this. And it's been very good, but I, th I think like from what I'm gathering, the rest is like stuff that might get bugged or might take a bit more precision and concentration to do and I'm gonna be totally honest it is 20 to 1 
1 a.m. in the morning, I simply cannot be bothered. <laughs> That's the only reason. I'm like, it's it's getting late. I should probably leave it at that. But I'm really glad I managed to finish the game and get all of the endings too. Like I that that I feel like I've accomplished what I set out to do. Good times. But yeah, this this has been so good though. I'm so glad I played this. It's like it's been something I have been meaning to do for so long. And like it, it was only recently I was like, yeah, it's it's probably about time I play Mist, right? That'd be good. But yeah, I think I will leave it at that for now because it is approaching one a.m. I should probably try and get some rest. But I, I was mostly just hoping to complete the game today, and honestly, it was smooth sailing once I actually figured out how to ac activate <laughs> the elevator. <laughs> The elevator was the part that took me the longest. It was so funny. But, oh, thank you so much for the follow as well. Thank you. Glad you decided to stick around. I like playing a lot of puzzle games. I'm I'm known for playing many puzzle games. I've got quite a lot under my belt. And I plan to play more, too. Like, my list of games to play is still massive. <laughs> but I'm definitely going to be playing Riven, so... So I think with that, I shall... Nope. I will head over here and see about ending the stream. But oh, it's been so fun. It's been so good. I'm so glad I decided to play this. It's, it's been a really good time. Uh, how long did it take me in total to clear? Um, I'd say maybe like either six or seven hours. I think probably closer to seven hours, but that's also with me streaming at the same time and getting very distracted. <laughs> I think that's like a, a longer playthrough time. It's not like super, super long, but it's, it's been so much fun. I, I really love doing this. Oh, Abduction, that's on my list of games to play as well. I actually have it as something I plan to play. I have it already. I, I think I got it free on Epic Games and I was like, I must play that. So that's actually one I, I have listed. <laughs> but uh, there's quite a few games that I have that I keep meaning to play, and then another game gets in the way. Uh, looking at you, Talos Principle 2, how dare you be so amazing. I, I, I love Talos too. <laughs> but yes, that feels like a good spot to end it at for now, though. And that will be it from me for now. I'm not sure if I'll be doing a Puzzle Sunday stream next week. If I do, it'll be earlier in the day, because I'm actually doing a little event stream next week thank you for many comfy sundays wait oh my goodness primal z thank you so much oh my goodness the the 50 dollars. that's that's so generous thank you so much i love that it like converted the currency <laughs> it was such a nice round number for the donation i i just saw in the activity feed and and chad's just like what is that in british pound sterling but, oh, thank you so much. That means so much. <laughs> but yeah, next week is, um, I'm going to be doing a little event stream, um, a little teaser. It's to do with the Studio Elan Bellflowers. Uh, we got something in store to reveal next Sunday on my stream, on my channel. Look forward to it. But it does mean I won't be doing the, the usual puzzle stream that I do on Sundays. And then also the week after that is my birthday. <laughs> So I'm going to be doing my birthday stream instead of the puzzle times. But honestly, knowing me, I'm probably going to find a way to sneak some puzzles into my birthday stream. It's I plan on doing a longer stream anyway, so I'm just I'm just going to be doing stuff. I don't know what I'll do. Maybe I'll maybe I'll play Zumbinis, who knows. <laughs> but yeah, I'm excited for that. I need to actually make plans for that. I I'm very unprepared. It's like two weeks away. I, I need to sort stuff. I need to sort stuff. I'll get there. <laughs> but yeah, this has been so fun though. I'm, I'm so glad I got to complete it. Even if I am missing a few achievements, that's fine. I'll get them eventually. I'll get my completionist collection another time. But let's find a target to send a raid on to. Let's see who is online at the moment, who's around. Oh, there's quite a few people I know online. Who do I want to raid? All of them. I want to raid everyone. Wait! Oh, 
Oh my goodness. Wait, I know who I want to raid. Oh, I hope they're still streaming. I hope they keep streaming for a little while. Um, I'm going to send the raid over to Kato, to Catnaps. I never get the chance to raid them because of our time zones not matching up. And they're live right now, so I want to raid them. I want to raid them. Their, their art is gorgeous. They are so lovely. And I want to send you over that way, so... I'm going to do that. I'm going to send you over to Kato. We're going from one cat to another. <laughs> but Kato's art is so beautiful. So gorgeous. Anyway, there is the raid message. If you're subbed, we will use the bongos. If not, we will send hearts. But I'm going to... I'm going to go... Um, probably go by Riven. <laughs> But yeah, this has been so much fun. I've, I've had such a blast. I'm so glad I finished it. Like, I'm I'm really, really glad I managed to get all of the endings because that's what I wanted to do this stream. Like, I, I knew it wasn't like a super, super long game. I was like, I bet I can do it today. So the fact that I did, I'm, I feel proud. I'm proud of myself. <laughs> but yes, oh, I hope everyone else has a lovely night too or rest of the day, whatever time zone it may be. But yes, I should go to bed now. Thank you so much, everyone, for joining me today. And until next time, bye-bye.